Well, we are playing. We are playing some hyper hyperspace, some FTL multiverse today. And uh, last week we did unlock a ship or two. We were playing Sylvan's Cruiser. We missed out on a couple unlocks because of the Nebula eating some jumps, some uh, some quests. I'm trying to remember which ones we unlocked. We played, yes, we played that one. Um, have I played the Ancient Cruiser yet? I don't think I've actually played the Ancient Cruiser. I think Ancient Cruiser is the one where, with this ship, you're supposed to get the true ending and that unlocks something, I think. Uh, I haven't played any of the Ancient ships. I think I want to play one of those next. I think I unlocked this guy, though, too. Rebel Cruiser. This looks new, too. I think I might start with an Ancient Cruiser today. One of the two Ancient ships we unlocked. Um, I don't have rehearsal tonight, so I can definitely get two runs in, as long as one's not six hours long, of course. Uh, hopefully your side effects will pass. Only been having about 30 minutes now. Okay. Uh, let's see. You got hit like a brick today. You got permission to skip work because your body was just numb and pain. Yeah, you should definitely skip work if you're getting side effects from that. Yeah. How is existence? It's, it's fine. It's fine for me. Yeah, I would go, if you if the chest pains continue, I would definitely go to maybe the place that you got the shot. I don't know. What's the 45 thing by this? I think that's the amount of health it has. I think it starts with extra health on this ship. Uh, Harbringer 1, it starts with 2 power for 4 shots. Harbringer drone. Let's start, I think the uh, ancient ship is actually one of the most OP ships you can play. So we're going to start with one of these. Is that a vaccination center, not a health clinic? So you have to go to a health, local health clinic. Yeah, I would if if the chest pains continue, I would definitely, I would definitely go do one of those things that other people are suggesting for sure. Okay, normal, confirm, continue, proceed, and let's see here. What do I want? A crew member would be a human that dies. Extra resources would be okay. Uh, if we get a weapon, we need to go with Ion because it sells for more. So let's go ahead and do that. And we're going to do our salvage mission. Okay. You want to be the drone on the shields. Uh, this is... Okay, let's look at all the stuff that's on this ship. So we have these ancient dudes. Machine-like people. Little is known about them. 200 health, 1.25 combat damage. Half repair speed. And they're slower. Can't burn or suffocate. This guy is a sentient AI construct built by the ancient ancients. They're immune to mind control. See it changes rooms. They're immune to suffocation. Slowly repairs itself. Has 70 max health. Can be switched between automated and full control mode. What does that mean? I can control you. Auto mode. Interesting. Why would I ever want it in auto mode, I wonder? All right, so you want to be that guy, eh, RPG Nerdos? Might call the health guide you have in Sweden for advice if it stays. Ancients are basically mantis on crack, okay. You had your second shot, you had a headache and backache, and you think low fever overnight and the next day. Didn't actually measure temperature, though. Then soreness at injection site for a few days. Yeah, I had, I had the soreness, and that's pretty much all I had, so... I'll see what the auto means when I test it. I did test it. He's not doing anything at an empty jump. I guess I'll leave it on auto for now. I assume he's the one I would want to do repairs, though, because ancients are slow repairs. I'm going to assume he's got normal repair speed. So it's basically how AI enemy crew, uh, AI crew, uh, do their stuff? Okay. Okay. There's no internal upgrade I can do, right? Uh, did this start with any augments? I don't know, actually. Already did salvage mission. Lay a trap on any missiles. Okay, so I don't think we do anything here. Hypercharge shields. Hyper powerful shielding that not only provides five hit points that resist penetration, also increases the recharge rate of your regular shields by 20%. Holy crap, this is Zoltan Shield plus shield recharge increase. That's insane. So, if I was going to beat, uh, 
What's his face? Sylvan. This would probably be one of the ships to do it, but uh, every time I start a new run, I think about doing that and then lose. So what's a mender drone? Fills in for the biggest weakness of the ancients. Repairing. Oh, okay. This is a laser tech. Does decent damage with extra system damage. So is this a... Uh, wow, we have artillery too. Is this a boarding drone? Let me see. These guys aren't boarding us. Let's test what this thing does. Turn that off. Oh, it's a, it's a laser drone. Okay. Uh, two delays. No thanks. I want your scrap. Okay. All right. Well, this ship is OP as hell, as expected. <laughs> Um, best ship to beat Sylvan with a Sylvan A because of the unlock. Okay. I'll bring her a space combat drone. Yeah, I wanted to test it. Uh, and then artillery is ancient beam sweeps across the entire ship, decimating the whole in systems. Okay. Just more max OPness. That's what it is. Up slow rider. Yeah, we're basically playing the board cube. Reject your offer. I don't think I need to be afraid of you, do I? I don't think so. Good drones. Auto fire. Heartbringer basically a heavy hull laser drone. Very strong. It can do insane damage if you get past shields. Seems like everything on this ship is insanely strong. Perfectly balanced as all things should be. Uh, you always have the med bay on for this ship since you keep getting crew that needs air. The med bay on. Oh, you mean clone bay. Okay. Ignore their cries. Uh, Harbinger is really good for bio killing. Maybe later. <laughs> it takes two shots to kill ship sector one, so I don't know about that. Uh, I don't really have anything to sell to the merchant. So do I want to go to the merchant? Unless I sell the simple ion, maybe. You constantly show, oh, shoot O2 with the uh, thing, and the O2 drain from the ship. I'm not doing that. Multiverse runs are always t already take me three to four hours. I'm not going to make it take an extra hour because I want to bio-kill every ship. Uh, it's so slow. I would like to do two ships today since last week I only did one, so... You're a greedy bugger? Yeah. Uh, uh, understandable. Maybe if we fight the... Um, what are they called? The, um... What are the people who... The plant people called? Orchids. We'll do that since they die quicker to that. I mean, you're gonna die over and over. Shells. Are they the ones that died low? Oh, that's right. They're the ones that died low, too, quicker. My bad. Yeah. Um... If that was not a human, maybe I consider it. So I'm not gonna do that though. Yeah, orchids were the wrong ones. It was the shells I was thinking of. Why not bio kill the slaver? Is this a slaver? I mean, because it takes forever. That's why. That's the reason is because. Okay, wow, well, we have already almost killed them. Because my artillery is gonna kill them. I already answered why I'm not bio-killing, because I don't want to spend five hours on this run. I'll probably already take four hours, although the ship is so strong. Hopefully it'll be three or less, and I can get a second run in today. Yeah, already is OP. Delete systems, yeah. Okay, alright. What I will say is, well, I was going to say they're not boarding because we have no O2, but I think they're not boarding because we have a Zoltan shield. All right, I'll one time shoot the O2 and see how effective this is. Let's find out. Well, that was bad. Okay, dodge tap our shots. The ship is basically the player counterpart of uh, the Sylvan. 
of stupid OPness. Yeah. There's the breach. No. Surrender. I don't know. You say it's a good crew killing. Um, I have a feeling they're going to repair before I can actually crew kill this. Because if I shoot them one more time with my Harbringer, I'll have to turn it off. Hope that hits. Okay, there we go. So I think that'll maybe work. So now I gotta wait an hour for them to die. And we take damage from them now. Ugh. You use cheat engines. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I don't like that. Oh, come on. 50% of every volley. If I had that, I wouldn't have taken damage already. There we go. Um, there's a way to change the speed with hyperspace without change. Heat engine is over console type speed. Yeah, I don't like doing that. Feels, that feels cheaty to me. All, all of that changing the speed feels cheaty to me. Maybe I'll eventually start doing it, but I don't want to get in the habit of changing the speed of FTL. All right, there we go. 14 scrap compared to probably nine if I hadn't crude killed them. It just doesn't feel worth the time to me. Um, all right, let's check out the merchant. Look for the ship. Okay. And to me, that's just not worth the time. I'm not trying to, like, streak here or anything. Yeah, nice heavy laser ship. This is the second, I think, ship like this we've seen. There's Double Breach. What's up, Gravy Genie? Actually, if I really wanted to go faster, I could shoot empty rooms because it's that double as a whole damage weapon. Yeah, let's actually do that. Wow. Does he actually get out? He's about to get out. I'm going to turn this drone on. I don't think he will. Get him, get him, get him. Okay, good. Um, accept him. We have clone bait. Alright. I think you actually can get group from that. I was taking that because it was a potential free human. Which then we could vent forever, which is definitely worth. A forever venting human is the best type of human. You got an email that I was streaming, so now you're here. Nice. You were watching Spider-Man 1. Alright. Um, I can sell five missiles, right? Yeah. All right. Is Spider-Man 1 the first Tobey Maguire one? Onslaught launcher. Two power, three shots per charge, uses one missile. Wow, yeah, that's like really strong, isn't it? Well, I don't have missiles. I wouldn't be using this at first. I would be using this for fleet delays potentially, and then maybe to use against the final boss. You just watched the scene where Spider-Man and Green Goblin fight for the first time. All those movies are in stars. I love those movies, actually. The first two... The first two Tobey Maguire Spider-Man movies I love. Um, it's the cheapest mine layer in the game. Found this out after using it once. Well, this is even cheaper than other mine layers for delaying. Wow, okay. I'm thinking about it just because it's another ancient weapon. Spider-Man 2 is a great superhero movie, movie in your opinion. It's one of my favorites for sure. Either seven for two or four for one. Uh, Neph, this is a fire chance, fire chance, fire breach. 
Yeah, Spider-Man 2 is such a good movie. All right, I'm taking that even though I don't have the missiles to use it because... Three, four, five. I can't get five here. One, two, three, four. Um, it can give us delays and uh, I'm thinking late game it'll be really strong. Yeah, Spider-Man 2 with Tobey Maguire, for the long, long, longest time, was my favorite superhero mu movie. The MCU, I feel like, has spoiled you young kids. Because way back in the day, we had junk like the crap Fantastic Four movie and, like, the, the ridiculous uh, Batman movies that were, where they had nipples on the suits and it was George Clooney. I mean, we had... And then the X-Men movies, which I always didn't like that much. Because, you know, Cyclops was a pansy, so... You kids today don't know how good you have with MCU actually good movies, you know? Um, do I even want to get O2? I kind of just want to get Hack and Cloaking and say, if we get any non-human crew, you, you get vented forever. Spider-Man 3 is good if you remove the Venom stuff. Uh, I don't know. I never found Spider-Man 3 to actually be that good. I didn't enjoy it as much. Do I care about this store? I don't think so. I guess I keep this guy, right? Let's get uh, Dodge and Power right now. I would have taken backup battery if they had that. You want to hold out for hacking and cloaking on this ship and go max OP ness. Nipples on the suit is hot, don't deny it. Uh, I will deny it because that's stupid. <laughs> uh, nipples on the suit is hot. Why don't they do that for the women's suits? Because that would be sexist or something, I don't know. It's just, it's just ridiculous. Yeah, missiles are a strong late game. Uh, Spider-Man 2 is fine enough, you guessed. I don't know, man. I saw Spider-Man 2 for the first time in the theaters when I was in college. And when What's-Her-Face as Mary Jane says, Go get him, Tiger, at the end. It's like, yeah! It's like, all right. Spider-Man is awesome. She says, Go get him, Tiger. Speaking of nipples on a suit... Kirsten Dunst being kissed in the rain in Spider-Man 2. That was pretty hot. That was pretty hot. Movies are a foreign language to you. You've never you never really were a movie kind of guy. You prefer your video games. Understandable. Definitely understandable. Uh if we don't get O2, we can't get a silly device. Silly device can be our mender bot or something, I don't know. Um, so I don't want to delay, but I do want to see how much it would Five missiles for two delay. Okay, nice, nice. All right, uh, can I talk to an ancient crew? My cognitive, talk to them. Wishes you installed hard light emitters. Cool. Uh, ancient Mender makes the weavers with upgrade look like Mantis in comparison. That was the fine enough part from Spider-Man 2. What, the part with Christ Kirsten Dunst? <laughs> uh, I should probably use an offensive drone here, but let's see how this goes. Engine Mender's like having two NGs on steroids fixing your stuff. Cool. NG has oxygen immunity with the uh, lab. Okay. It will be kind of hard to get the lab when I don't have heal bay. I'm going to have to actually spend more resources on it. So we can have an NG on the ship, okay. You watch that one scene in No Way Home trailer with Doc Ock like 80 times? <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty hyped. I'm definitely pretty hyped for Spider-Man No Way Home. Tom Holland, even as much as I love the, um... Tobey Maguire Spider-Man movies, because Spider-Man's always been one of my favorite superheroes, and Spider-Man 2 was my favorite for the longest time. Tom Holland is honestly probably a better... Uh, Spider-Man. Holy free conservative beam. Wow, that's amazing. How much it is for the onboard lab? 
how much it is. You know what? Let's go ahead and get that now. We can afford it. Okay. Wow, free conservative beam is insane. Um, but Tom Holland, like, age-wise, look-wise, attitude-wise, he's probably the best character and actor for Spider-Man we've had between you know, Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield. Was that his name? Okay. Uh, I have a feeling they won't give me free stuff here. Yeah, I think I would have to have a human or some something like that. Okay, so Link can start the the uh, the true ending quest, right? You need an NG. Not for the. Okay, I think you're saying you need an NG for the free stuff. Tom Holland is a better P Peter Parker. Yeah. Also, I just like Tom Holland. He's seems like a good guy. Seems like a guy I could be friends with. Okay. All right. So it looks like we didn't get the quest here. There's a chance for the quest to give you free stuff, or the guard to give you free stuff without NG. Depends on NG. Okay. What's up, Corvax? All the Spider memes are cool. It sucks that some of the movies don't show off how cool they are. Spider Man. You really hope they keep Garfield Spider Man making the Spider Man of the Sony movies. I, I never liked Andrew Garfield. He was too cool. Um. It's only going to be the true ending quest if it's the NG Harmony exclamation point. Okay. Uh, well, the last guys didn't give us supplies, so I'm going to attack them. I'm doing well, Cruel Angel. Good to see you, my friend. So it was a one and three for me to get the quest here, and I didn't get that. We're pretty sure outside the NG Harmony links are only one and six for true ending, okay? Excuse me, I've been sneezing a lot the last couple days. Goodness. Okay. Bless me, thank you. Appreciate it. You tend just to man stuff from guards if you have no blue options and you're strong. You either get into fight or a guard gives you something. I never use the demand option. I guess maybe I should check it out. Whoops, I auto, I'm auto-firing now, which I don't want to do with conservative beam. Okay. That's good, though. All right, our doges are good, though. It's a pretty fast shield recharging right there. Oh my gosh, these dodges, man. Of course, of course you hit my artillery a one in like 40 or something right before it charges up. Cool. Cool, yeah, this ship is stupid OP. Um, goodness gracious. My ship is OP and this ship is freaking beating me right now. No, F your mercy request. Okay, that's a nice double reward though. Let's check out how fast this Mender drone is. Oh, I can control it. Cool. You tend to just demand stuff from guards. Yeah, uh, I think demand is either fight or free loot, and always minus reputation. Could be wrong, though. Minus reputation doesn't matter, though. Always guarantees you get something. Yeah. Well, I should have maybe demanded that then. You can't man systems, right? No. Okay. I'll have you hang out there. Okay. Uh, let's get our second shield then. We've been a lot safer in that fight if I had gotten that already. Uh, look at that repair speed, chef's kiss. Mwah. All right, it's free fuel. Energy store. I do have the guard missile drone to sell. All right, we'll go one, two. Audio room graphics is clipping out of the room boundary. Boundaries mod ruined. All right, we want to do the salvage mission. Whoo, free tracking flares. Holy shnikes. 
Play multiverse for over 80 hours, still have no clue what reputation does. Alright, check out what's for sale. And I can do the delay. Let's do that. Long range scanners. Okay. Check the lab. What could I have checked the lab for? I want to get my delay in. Man, if I get long range scanners, I have no more augment slots, man. And this is another problem with multiverse. There's there's too much stuff that you can't make internal, so augment slots are even more valuable. Um, because I don't want to get rid of tracking flares. That's OP on the final fight. Like if I get this and I'm offered, what what could I not get? Automated reloaders. Ah, uh, I guess I'll get it anyway. Just, man, oh, I could have gotten backup battery here. I should keep this drone. A defense drone is also what I want. Ancient and cognitive upgrade just to see what they're like. Some of them are really spicy. Okay, I'll check it out eventually. Wish I could get battery. Okay, ignore. All right, onboard lab, ancient. Mortality initiatives. Who's their fire and asphyxiation resistance? Gain 50 more health and 25% more combat damage. So I can't do that with no O2. You can see adjacent rooms, resist mind control, or immune to stun. Okay. Five times combat damage, wow. All other enemy crew I gain three times damage. Okay, so just make all fights faster. That's a weird one. All right, what about this guy? Cognitives do 75% less melee damage, but do triple ranged damage. Uh, passively drain oxygen so they become like Lanius. Uh, and power while in auto mode. Okay. Oh, that is cool. Power while in auto mode. Do I want to do that? That's basically 35 scrap for this guy becoming power. If I get multiples of those, I'd want it. I don't know that I want that for just one guy. Uh, I already did this salvage right, yeah. Five times damage makes every melee fight a one shot or near. Okay. Sorry, I have, a, I have a Zolten Shield. Let's do it. Makes it important to position units correctly for the triple range damage. Is a cool ability. Yeah, that's cool. Don't have cloaking. Um, let's go ahead and do this to get through your Zolten Shield before Pulsar fires, hopefully. Just in time. Nope, no surrender, you die. Only that upgrade if you have Clone Bay for safety because it's really intriguing me to mess up, yeah. <laughs> Extra stuff from a, from a Pulsar, that's interesting. Timing on this is, it's pretty good. I wouldn't say it's amazing. But it's pretty, it's pretty good timing. God, this track is loud. Or maybe my music is just loud or something. Uh, so I have seven jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. What's up, Chris Doodle? Okay, no cloaking. Don't need to use tracking flares. He's got the repair drone, eh? Pretty good weapons. Acting malfunction is always a track you can have at full blast. Is that what this is called? What is this ship I'm using? This is the ancient something. The ancient. Wow, that's freaking ridiculously fast repairs. 
Uh, it's the ancient ship that we unlocked at one point with some thing that we did because there's so much stuff you could do in this game and I can't remember it all. There we go. Thank you, artillery. What a an insane ship. Constant repairs with, I'm gonna guess, multiple NGs repairing. Yeah, no wonder I couldn't keep anything offline. Beam does 10 system damage? It does? Holy crap. Wow, another free drone. That's amazing. Um, I wonder if I went like full artillery upgrade if I could do some of the harder fights I couldn't do previously. So killing Sylvan with this ship wouldn't unlock anything, correct? Killing Sylvan only unlocks something if you kill him with Sylvan, is that correct? That's correct, okay. So the only ship I actually want to kill Sylvan with is Sylvan then. Okay, tracking flares, yes. It's a pretty cool track, though. There's a few others. Uh, should be correct anyway. Only a few ships in the game have the requirements of beating Sylvan to unlock a new ship. I don't know. Niren's telling me something different now, so I don't know what's what's true then. <laughs> I thought you unlocked something just by beating Sylvan for the first time, but now that I have Sylvan unlocked, I don't, I don't know. Right, saving scrap to try to get a uh, system. Um, you know what? I'll actually take that deal. Uh. If they give me a map that would be useless, I'm gonna attack them. Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm killing you. Sorry. I am an ancient. I feel no fear or mercy. <laughs> what are you doing? Killing your face. Get one shot. All right. Uh, the last shot will haunt you for the rest of your life. <laughs> uh, I should not read any of that. It might make me feel bad about my choices in life. Okay. The ancients feel no guilt. Angies feel no, no fear. Ancients feel no guilt. And so hacking cloaking, that's what I'm looking for. I'm hoping to make this ship strong enough that if we do get another NG sector with the Harmony Link and get the true ending quest, we can actually do it with this ship because I'm pretty sure you all have told me that unlocks a quest or unlocks a ship, so. Ancient crew is the perfect war crime crew. Okay, nice double reward. Okay. I have just enough for cloaking. Uh, no thanks. And I've already done, whoops. I've already done my salvage, yeah. I think there's anything I want to do here. Damn, all right, well there's teleporter at least. Virus, cell. Actually, this is really good, isn't it? This is a really good anti-missile drone, if I'm not mistaken. Is that correct? This is like a better defense one, if I'm not mistaken. So yeah, this is actually great. Uh, so the only thing we'd want would be like uh, weapons then. I'm growing up. Remember to check my salvage missions. Yes, I'm growing up. Okay, backup battery's nice. 
Basically, I need to get any crew... I should get the NG so I can turn him into the, uh... Doesn't need oxygen thing. So he's gonna slowly die. He's gonna be Silly Device, but I will not name him Silly Bi Device until... We get the uh, immunity to O2 upgrade. So hopefully I can get that. Hopefully I didn't just spend too much scrap that I can't get that now. Okay, explore. Poor, poor silly device. I don't want to do this to you, but I currently have no choice. I think it's 25 scrapless drone parts. Okay, well, after this fight, we should have that. So hopefully I'll be able to do that fairly early in the next... Uh, next sector, I'm hoping. Cool ship design right there. Nice double reward. All right. Wow. S46L or S26L. So lucky. So many choices. Liberated sector. Um, that's separatist. So this is a separatist NGs. Okay. So I think we have another chance at Link here, but that's, so that's good. All right, so Onboard Lab, NG, Environmental Adaption. There it is, only two Fuel 5 drone parts, absolutely worth. Beautiful. Okay. And Salvage Mission. Wow! So far from my salvage missions, I've gotten a free tracking flares and a free chain flak. Holy shnikes. Uh, am I playing on normal normal? Yeah, I believe so. Uh, three projectiles. Two power for three shots. Okay, so in order to use that... I could get that online right now if I wanted to. I don't think I need to have the onslaught on my bar for it to be useful. That is a good upgrade because I'm going to need more shield penetration power, I believe. So let's go ahead and do that. A laser sided flak, you know it. Holy schnickers! Holy schnickerdoodle! Chris Doodle? <laughs> uh, try to communicate. Attack. Okay. I forget what's here. Separatist Scout. Okay. I had to do that a little earlier. Yeah, one shot. Alright, scraps remains. Murder bot dispersal. <sighs> Why can't you put augments in the cargo, man? This is this is There are some things that bug me about hyperspace, I mean uh, multiverse. This is one of the biggest ones. If you're gonna add this much junk, you have to make the game possible to do something with the junk. Make make over capacity augments sellable anywhere. Make them so they can break them down into pieces where you, when you get them. Because there's only three augment slots, you can't put them in cargo. It's a complete, absolute, 100% waste. It's like, why even have this in the game if you can't use it? It just shouldn't be in the game if you can't use it. Yeah, just make it so they can break them down for some amount of scrap. Because if you can't put them in the cargo, it's pointless to have these rewards. Um, 
Let's see here. Uh, suzerain ship. Attack him. So this was the link, and I think we failed again at getting the true ending thing here. And just make them scrappable. Just make every augment scrappable. It's already it's already in the code because you can do it if you already have the augment. I think they just need to make every augment scrappable if it's uh if it's overflow or whatever. Locked augments you feel should be integrated into the ship, not take an augment slot. What are locked? Oh, oh yeah. Well, I think I think locked augments. Well, not all of them can be do internal things. Yeah, I agree with that. I augment slot. This is one of the most limiting things in the game. Is augment slots only being limited to three and not being able to go into cargo? So that's just always going to be something that bugs me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. Hail. Okay. Uh, create a fuel. Create a missiles, create a drone parts. She wouldn't mind some extra drone parts, but I'm not gonna do that. Wait. You weren't an actual store, though? Okay. Worth to know for this specific event, you can ask Suzerain before comment about slaves. He'll offer an engine defender for high amounts of scrap. Okay. Yeah, this ship is like one of the yeah, most difficult ships to obtain because you have to get a bunch of quest things in a row for to to get it, I believe. Okay. Need to buy that for the store. Need to buy what? Oh, I needed to actually buy drone parts or the other things to get the store? No. Oops. That's weird. Did they tell you that in the event and I just didn't read it? Rise of Terror go in vain. That's actually not a bad deal. Let's see how much scrap we get. Hopefully it's more than 39. Wow, their deal was actually better than the rewards we got there. So I'm going to not do the delay here because this layout in the direction I went makes it not worth the missiles I would spend, I think. Um... Yeah, tracking flares. Power go out from there. I'm confused. Can they come from my shields? Oh well. This should be basically just need to encounter one specific event, which can be found in multiple sectors. After that, no RNG is involved. For what? For the true ending quest? We're talking about the Harmony Link one, right? Which I've done twice and haven't gotten the one in whatever chance yet. I think adding more augment slots would require hyperspace. Well, I, I don't necessarily think that they need to add more slots here. I just want augments to be placeable in cargo. But that would require hyperspace, absolutely. Either let them be put in cargo or break them down if you don't have space for them. Alright. Uh, Mantis would die over and over. There's not a lab upgrade to make Mantis not take... No O2 damage, right? Hmm. 
Okay. Let him forever reincarnate. I don't want to have to mess with that. I don't want to have to have two extra power on my ship all the time, or even just one for home bay being on all the time. It's not. It's not something I want to be stressing out the entire run about. Uh, crystals don't need an air upgrade with a lab upgrade. Okay, so basically the crew we can get are Lanius, Crystals. Actually, um, nice. I was going to say Orchids, but they can't provide O2 if there's no O2 system, right? I think that mechanic doesn't work if there's no O2 system. What's that, my drone control? That's a Mender drone. Which is a really, 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 really fast repairing drone to make up for the fact that these ancient crew are really slow at repairing. Lanius crystals, ghost, morphs, and NG separatists don't need out too. I don't think it's just NG separatists because this is a normal NG and yeah, he's just a normal NG. And with the upgrade, he doesn't need the uh, doesn't need anything special. We do have a store coming up. Augmented, though? Okay, Orchid, Orchid Chieftains work since they don't provide O2, but they're immune to suffocation. Okay. Sounds like some special crew. So I've already done that. A trap's not worth it. Um, oh, and you separate just have a skill. Ah, okay, I got you. I could take runes because I have anaerobic crew. Okay. Uh, do I want to install any turtle upgrades? Is there a... If I did the respirators... I would need... That wouldn't, uh... Are there any crew that with respirators and an upgrade, they would not need it? Orchid Chieftains make people immune to suffocation. Okay. I don't I don't know if there's any crew that with respirators would survive it. Maybe crystals. I don't think I want to do any of these yet though, because we have a store coming up. I'm not gonna do scrap recovery arm. Because we have a store coming up and I don't wanna how much how much does scrap recovery arm? Fifty? Honestly, drone recovery arm sounds pretty nice because we have a defense drone and an offensive drone. I'm actually thinking about drone recovery arm. I'm going to take this because now I can use my Harbringer. And uh, that'll be another offensive thing we can do. I like that. Okay. One thing you do is respirators, high level med bay, and med bots. Yeah. Board the ship, anaerobic crew, weapon, drone part, drone here. Is this uh, is this an ancient thing? So would this be an ancient weapon? If I could get another Harbringer, that would be insane. They have good drones, of course, too, and I did just get drone recovery arm. Hmm. Small chance for Harbinger. Whenever you play the ship, you immediately sold the drone. Eradicator. Okay. Those friggin' things right there. Alright, Eradicator. Two power, 80 length beam, two hull damage, two system damage, 30 crew damage, 100% breach chance. Holy shnikes, okay. Wow, okay. Um, 
Well, I want to use that instead of the uh, conservative beam now. Yeah, that's... We have really good weapons. We're like almost a full ancient... Uh, equipped ship here. Still want to wait to get it online before the store, because until the store, I, I want cloaking or hacking. Explore. Nice. Basically, two power halberd, yeah. Um, I've already done my stuff, yeah. Don't need a trap. Okay. Would it be worth getting a Separatist NG? Uh, we're gonna sell that. Whatever I do, I'm getting the Eradicator online, so I'm gonna do this. You don't think it's worth getting a Separatist NG? I want more bodies. Well, that's the thing. I don't have... There's not a... There's a lot of crew that won't survive on the ship if I am committed to not getting O2, which I'm pretty committed to. Yet so many units in Multiverse are free. Yeah, but not so many that are immune to no O2 damage is the thing. Uh, how much will it be to be this? Since I already have an NG, I won't. I will not spend the scrap on the crew. I have lots of scrap and a good loadout. Well, yeah, I have a good loadout after doing that. So, explore. I wanted to uh, I wanted to upgrade my weapon system. This is an insane six power weapon system. Well, it's not so much the manning that I wanted him for. I wanted him for, I think there's some different options for a separatist NG than a regular NG, if I'm not mistaken. We're really close to one shot most of these ships, I think. Deny the request at salvation. Using a beam, I could put three breaches in a room and watch the enemy Mantis crew take years to fix them. I could, and that would take forever, though. So, as fun as that sounds, I like my runs to not take five hours. <laughs> yeah, I got a chain flag for free from a. God, where did I get that from? Oh, these are really good sectors. We got two NG and then Galactic uh, Senate. I didn't get that from. Uh, from a salvage, did I? Okay, contact the guard. I'm not going to demand because I don't want to do that here. I'm going to request. Okay, nice. Thank you. That guy looked pretty strong. I didn't want to fight him. I'd have to go through two nebula, nebulae to get an extra jump. Sure, let's do that. Old Ever Shane Flack isn't as OP as the viewership one. Yeah, I know. It's still too power for three shots, though. What's the issue? Giant spiders. Okay, so this is giant alien spiders. So to crew kill them, we kill O2, right? Okay. Kill O2 and the uh, heal bay. Yeah, I'll eradicate her on O2 and med bay. Um, and you know what? I'm gonna get, they have doubled missiles, so let's get our guard drone out. Okay, I just, the, the thing I have to worry about is not doing too much damage to them. But I do want one of their missiles offline. So we got one off, so now our defense drone should be good. Uh, actually, no, let's do this. How many shots is that laser? Lucky they don't have a maintenance drone.
Okay, so they're never going to be able to fix that. The only worry is taking damage from this laser. Let's do, um... Do this so our shields stay online here. Uh... Okay, yeah, we'll be fine. We'll win a fight. Ancient between a spider. What a fight. No O2? I think we're good to win that fight. Should be basically immune to damage, I think. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's a two-shot. Sorry, I thought it was a three-shot. My bad. Alright, they will, they will die eventually. This is probably going to be the easiest kill giant alien spiders quest we've ever had. We've done this one multiple times. Eradicator. Made specifically for eradicating giant alien spiders. I don't think he's going to board us anymore either, is he? Because of his low health. Can't imagine giant alien spiders being like this, except you send a crew to deal with them. Okay. Alright, ask about spiders. Okay. Did that... That didn't give me a quest. Wasn't that supposed to give me a quest? Oh no, that unlocks the giant alien spider sector now, doesn't it? I think it's a sector that that unlocked, if I remember correctly. Alright. So I guess if we get a sector we don't like, we can change it to giant alien spiders. Which... Is that better? <laughs> I guess depending on the, uh... Depending on the other options. Doodle 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 do 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 Hmm. Oh, that breaches. I mean, pierces. Yeah, two- wow. Two whole damage beam that breaches. Man, is that OP. That is friggin' OP. All the weapons we have are OP. Our least OP weapon is the Chain Flak. How's that for... OP-ness? Did I already get both a types A and B Spider Cruiser? I'm about 80% sure that I did, yeah. Okay. So we need two Nebulae to get the extra jump. Within the salvage, I haven't. Let's go ahead and do the um, trap right now. As good as time as any to do it. Sun. Sun and a s in an ion thing. God, that's so confusing. Um. So it's, this will do the half pursuit, I think. Even though it's a solo flare and this thing at the same time. Oh, it's not half power. Okay. And I'm still rather confused. Oh yes, I forgot. I have a drone recovery arm. I should be turning this on thing on every time. I need more power for that. Have some breaches, sir. Oof, man, you have a lot of lasers, man. Ha! Ah, killed by our solar flare, and solar flare does basically nothing to us, so that's nice. Uh, let's get you to repair. This guy can help. Huh. He didn't move to repair. Interesting. Oh, because I control him. <laughs> Why didn't you move? I forgot. He's a manual control. I'm so not used to manual control drones. Okay. Let's 
Salve omnibus et singulis. Sorry for being late. <laughs> What's up, Tlotro? Okay, you are forgiven. Oh my gosh, these guys' weapons are crazy. I need to get three shields for most of these freaking fights. Do, 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 do. Mainly just because my weapons are slow. Now, if I get pre-igniter, I would definitely get rid of one of the augments I have for that. Although pre-igniter is only from that certain event, that's right. Keep forgetting about that. Okay. Tiller on the ship is an RD beam that does 10 system damage. Yeah, it's crazy. I I should upgrade that too, but I still I haven't gotten a single system from a store, and I'm in a civilian sector, so I want to have enough scrap to get either hacking or cloaking. So I'm not spending all of my scrap on upgrades yet. Uh, I'm not giving in to your rainbow multiverse color demands. Oh god, he's gonna get through my Zoltan shield immediately. Wow, you are really freaking strong. God, these ships are super strong, man. Don't hit my weapons, please. Okay. No, I can't do my Mender drone and my Harbinger drone at the same time. They're super strong. Good thing we're playing like the most OP ship in the game. Auctions for the week, you know it. Oxygen is for the, the humans, and why would we ever want, have, want to have one of them on our ship? Okay. Yeah, I have been facing some terrifying ships. Good thing uh, our ship is even more terrifying. <laughs> Yeah, so that's what I'm doing. No, that's totally what I'm doing. Oh, free shield hack. Free shield hack? How about you have uh, my four damage dealing drone? What? Holy crap. That thing does four damage to empty rooms? Holy whole drone, that's insane. Yes, yeah, the double double shield shield hack hack on that guy. It's two damage and double on systemless rooms. It's crazy. Um reject their offer and substitute my own of killing you. You you're gonna <laughs> yeah. This little guy is you you are threatening me? Uh, I could threaten him, but I'm just gonna kill you because you are the weakest ship I've seen in the last like two sectors But I have a burst laser too. Yeah Yeah, you do You do Let's see how well that does when I frickin one shot you bro If I can't one shot this ship, I'll be pretty Disappointed in myself. Get one shot. First laser two. Heavy laser is decently strong for sector one vanilla. It's actually OP sector one vanilla. We're in sector four, so it's not very strong. <laughs> and we're also in multiverse, so. Alright, so I'm look store. I'm looking for cloaking or hacking. Um they offer drones. No, oh, never mind. Okay. 
<sighs> Without oxygen, man, they're gonna offer it at every store. I've seen mind control like four times now. Have I tried drone micro? I don't know what that means. Um. I mean, I guess I could go mind control plus cloaking or hacking. It's gonna be really hard to find the systems we want with the way stores are so limited in multiverse. I have three more sectors. I guess I don't have to commit to one yet, though. And we, we have a chance of finding another store over here. All right, fight. I could scout. But no, I don't want to do that. We could delay again if we get an empty jump, actually, and get more jumps, too. So that, that might be the best thing to look for here. That thing's going to get through our shields really quick, I believe. One shot, get one shot. Okay, one, two, three, four, all right. I might actually even be able to delay at the store if it gives me that opportunity. If I visit the market, will it give me the chance to not, to, to delay the fleet? Hailing scientist gives no delay, but does visiting the market let me get to do the delay? Okay, there we go. Let's do that. I've already done my salvage. Oh, I haven't even done my salvage yet. All right, I still want to lay a trap for the fleet, though. I don't want extra jumps. Systems. <sighs> no systems. Parabot Dispersal. One of the best augments in the game. Take ship parts, dislodge fossil vehicle vessels, convert to metals, repair your hull. More power means more bots are available to convert enemy parts. I mean, what do I get rid of? Zoldan Shield, Tracking Flares, Long Range Scanners. I guess Long Range Scanners, but this gets me so much scrap throughout the run. It uses system power to repair. That does sound pretty awesome. You say repair bots are great if you get them for free. Yeah, I kind of don't want to spend scrap on them, honestly. God, this track is so loud. Alright, well, uh, unless I get another NG, I don't think I get anything else here. Man, cannot get systems this run. <laughs> you think the value is worth, since you never have to pay for repairs again? Yeah, I don't know. But is it worth an augment slot? That's what I keep talking about. Augment slots are so valuable, and all the augments I have are super valuable, so... To me, my augment slot is worth more than potentially not having to spend scrap on repairs because there are events and other things that can get us repaired too so yeah the insane arty ship this ship is just insane in many ways i would say So, there's no human upgrade that lets me take less O2 damage. But he can... He does regenerate. So this guy regenerates for free when he's not fighting. 
Would this guy with his free regeneration and the uh, uh, oxygen thing keep him alive? Suffocation prevents regeneration. Does it? Really? Suffocation, is that considered being in combat? Okay, well then never mind. I guess taking any sort of damage is considered being in combat. Wow, that's a lot of NGs on that ship. Whole ship has Necron vibes. Necron, huh? Are those the enemies from Chronicles of Riddick? Ne ne those are Necromongers, aren't they? Um, I'll lead them to your destination. Uh, of course you give it, you put it in the only place. Why the hell wouldn't it put this in the next sector? What, how, how does quest generation in FTL work? Can somebody, can somebody explain to me how the F it works? We had literally two jumps left. No, three jumps left and it put it in this. But I'll have ones where I'll have like 12 jumps left and it'll put it in the next sector. How the hell does quest generation work in FTL? Can somebody explain it? Because it makes no effing sense. Pray for the chance to dump more mines. I mean, I can get it. And it'll only be a single dive exit. Uh, I don't know what Augmented B is. Is that another ship? Hopefully there's a store that will let me delay again or something. Eh, it's free stuff at least. What is Augmented B? Is that a ship? I don't know if I have the Augmented ships unlocked or not. Suffocating Lanius layout B. I don't know if I've unlocked Lanius ships yet, actually. I feel like I haven't. Well, that's awkward. How? Oh. You started a fire. It's like, what the hell started that fire? Pretty sure I can survive a dive. Well, I mean, I have the health for it, but... It's more the fact that I don't know how much damage I could potentially take from a dive. I have layout A of the green and pink ship. Okay. Honestly, I don't know that the 15 missiles is worth that with how much you can do with missiles in this mod. Let's go ahead and just do this. I couldn't remember if you got the augmented ships on my true ending playthrough. I don't I don't remember. Okay. That's a really strong ship, that's for sure. Augmented ship unlock is doing the three ruins. Oh, yeah, I did the three ruins, I think. Like 35% sure I did that. Nice. What are you gonna hack my battery, eh? Okay. I think he wins against two humans. With no O2. Thank you for the follow. Hey, Scott Finn, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome to stream. Okay. Three damage dive is pretty good, I will say. Do I even care about a breach? Breach does not matter. Okay, so... NG Sector Militia Encampment. NG Sector has another chance for getting true ending, right? But Militia Encampment, I don't know if I've done whatever the unlock here is. Yeah, I don't think I've done this one. So, I guess the question is, do I really want to go for the true ending by looking for the 
Link again in NG Sector for the third time, or do I go to the militia encampment? I think do NG. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I'd have to find this sector, and again, like stores, there's so many sectors, it's kind of rare to find a very particular sector. Uh, but I think I kind of do want to see if I can find the true ending one. Okay, we don't want to do infested. Contact. Request assistance with NG crew. Nice. Yeah. Alright, so we're looking for the link again. And the one and three or whatever it is to, to get that. Mission unlock quest is one of the biggest event chains in the game for a single beacon event. Okay. Check their offer and substitute my own. How about I kill you? And then you give me all your stuff. How's that for a deal? How's that for a deal? Finish him off. Get one shot, bro. Nice. And then you get a unique human. Well, sadly, that wouldn't be too good for us right now. Alright, in case Link's down here, I'm gonna check this. Plus a quest to fight a ship. Okay. Aid the civilian ship. It's cool. Manta ship, look at all these fins you have. Why can't I hold all these fins? Veseli Bonker has gifted a sub to double tap that. <laughs> Welcome, double tap that to the randoms, and thank you so much, Veseli Bonker, for gifting a sub. That's super generous. It's one of those quests with a lot of reading, though, and if you screw up, you lose a crew member, and Clomay doesn't save you. Technically, counts as a single volley if the projectiles never stop coming. Okay. Civilian ship. Darn, no double reward. Okay. Alright, I can still get to that one if I go to the store. And all I care about is finding the link. Search for store. Find a store. I think this is the one. Yeah, I just didn't do this. Damn it. God damn it. This is the one where you don't have time or whatever. Not enough time. Stupid event. Well, I sure hope... I sure hope Link Quest is not here, because I've just now lost the ability to get to it. Well, if I go one, two, three, I can get to it. Stupid event. Uh, two power. This is the thing that does insane system damage. There's, I'm never getting a better weapon than what I have. Alright, cloaking or hacking? Can I get both? 280. I'd have to sell something. Crew damage missile. Okay. Oh, guard 2. That's an even better version of the one we have, but... Cloaking. Does advanced FTL navigation augment still exist? In this mod, I... There's probably a improved version of it is my guess but i can't remember off the top of my head you know i have an ng i kind of want to sell this guy if i can sell him plus something else to get to get the hacking you can get advanced ftl navigation as an internal augment okay um I don't really want to sell anything, so I'm going to hope that with two more sectors of stores, I can find hacking. I have to take a, an inefficient jump in hopes of getting the link here. Hopefully this will be an empty beacon and I can delay the rebel fleet. I didn't even get to do my uh, re- um, Thanks salvage mission last time. Oh wow, another gifted sub. Thanks, Vaseli Banker. That's Vaseli Banker. That's Bank <laughs> Vaseli Bankar. Sorry, I'm probably saying your name wrong. Yeah. 
fucking cat. That's the ship. That's the shit thing that's got like five shots or something. Takes forever to authenticate these. What the gifted subs? Well, it is almost September, so it'll be even cheaper next month. I got the uh, message from from Twitch. Next month is the month to do the crazy gifting subs, is because they're like half price or something like that. You're testing the sub gifting. Well, thank you for the test. It's my favorite type of test. The Supporting the stream with money test. Show no mercy. Whew, that's a nice double reward. What is this one? Combat 2 for 3 power. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Watch the link be there that I didn't go to. God, how do I how do I check every jump? I'm able to check more if I go this way. So I just hope the link's not there, I guess. You need to test giving me a thousand dollars by giving me one dollar. Okay, go for it. <laughs> Who wants to test giving me a million dollars by giving me one billion dollars? That's the that would be the best test. Do 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 do. Do, do, do. What a generous deal that I'm going to turn down. I check every jump by getting a free map update or lay a tarp. Oh my, I could lay a tarp. 22 scrap. Okay. Well, I could have got hacking if that was available here. Hmm. Thinking about selling the Mender drone so I can use the combat drone. What do you all think? It'd be crazy offense. Mender drone's really good at repairs. I don't know if there's any blue options with for Mender drones. You're not an Arabian prince. You are a Persian prince. Ah, you don't have enough money. Because we could have such a crazy offense with Harbringer drone, combat laser, and these three weapons. I'm gonna do that. I'll need to get three more drone power to use it, but. Mender drone heals crew in the same room? Uh, oh well. So I've seen two stores. Let me do one upgrade on my drone control so far. Know what you love? Know what you love that they added multiverse conservative drones. Nice. Reward to anyone who repairs it. If it's an augment, that would be a waste. But if it's anything but an augment, I think it's worth. Ho ho ho! Another offensive drone. Holy crap. I could have an eight power drone system. That would be insane. Sometimes that just fights you? Okay. What's up, Plunder Pig? Am I winning? Always. Always. Hey, look, I found the free five hole damage. I'm pretty sure I checked every jump except for this one. The link is guaranteed, right? If I lay out the tra trap at the store, would that let me get it? You think so? Well, let's find out. Uh, this is an event, right? So I can't do a trap, right? Is there any way to make this be a trap delay? Pick two. Okay, do something on board. Thank God. Task. 
trap. All right, there's hacking. All right, all right, we got it. I think we dive for this. But it's still a chance at the true ending quest, so... There's our final system we've been looking for. All right, so with cloaking, I'm gonna lose the guard drone. We're gonna go for some ridiculous offense. All right. So what is it, one and three? Oh, uh, it's got that cool background. I think that's it, right? Yes, okay. I think we got it. So... Help me remember how to do this. Destroy the ship first. You wonder if that's enough drones to shred Sylvan shields? Man, I feel like it. if it's not, it's gotta be close. One or two gives you extra scrap, but you take damage. Okay. With my ship, I think we're fine to go for this. Tracking flares. Okay. You always destroy the ship? Okay. That's pretty cool that it can hit these things outside of there. Okay. okay, this goes haywire. Apparently his cloaking works now, for some reason. This thing's about to fire, so I'm gonna cloak it. You think you're an ancient ship? I'll show you ancient ship. I am the true ancient ship. You are an imposter. Please don't be like an augment I have to hold on to or something. Okay, quest marker to the next sector. Cool. Awesome. I think tracking players don't work on this ship since they don't turn on cloak till later. Okay. So that, that was a bait. I, I got you baited with the players. Just don't go spiders. Right. Okay. I want power for days and drone control upgrades. That's what I want. No, actually, I kind of want an artillery upgrade right now first. Let's do that. This drone was a gateway drug for the ancient ships. That's right. I should keep the onslaught, yeah. I was thinking about selling it to get other stuff, but... I should be able to delay again and not have a dive, I think. Do something on board. Task. Trap. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Uh, we bought it, never used it, now sell it. What are you talking about? We used it like five times. We've delayed... We've gotten like ten extra jumps from this thing. We got it for the delay. I'm not going to sell it yet. Because the delay is the, is the real value out of that. I mean, I haven't used it. I've been using it almost every sector. Uh... Okay. Yeah, the delays are the real reason to get that. We need drone recovery armor at this point to keep our numbers up. I have that already. Double tap that. I got that. Uh, sector two ago. Way ahead of you, my friend. Way ahead of you. You feel like you could probably wreck Sylvan, though there isn't any unlock for it. Just the loot. Well, I feel like... Time I think I'm good enough for Sylvan, I get wrecked myself, so I don't know, if you think so, maybe I can go for it. We'll see. If I'm doing the true ending, I won't see the real Sylvan, right? We get the other Sylvan thing. How's the engine not suffocating? Uh, we did a lab upgrade that makes them immune to suffocation. Oh man, I can even get this and then the exit? Nice. 
never seen this mod before. Multiverse is kind of the biggest FTL full rework mod out there because it's being uh, modded, uh, hyperspace is being uh, developed alongside it. It's a terrible deal, I'm gonna attack you. Yeah, the, the boarding drones and mind control are what I'm worried about for the whole trying to do Sylvan things. Every time I think I can do it, it's just the boarding gets so out of hand. Probably tough to power everything. Yeah, it might be worth getting the power upgrade on this guy and then maxing my power and the backup battery. The, the main issue, I think, for all the stuff I want to get for this, this, this ship is... Um, power it's a pretty good deal last time I didn't take this deal I actually missed out on scrap so I'm gonna take that deal although we do have uh, for the boarding the combat drones are bad but the slugs the slug boarding they would just get vented right okay I can do my I could do my salvage that I never did. Okay. I don't know if exploring would have been worth the salvage, but... So, so I'm supposed to not go to the infested sector. Is that right, Math Champ? If I go to the infested sector, does that mess up the uh, ancient quest, ancient sector thing? Don't go to the infested. Okay. The quest goes away. Okay, that seems like a bug. Is it supposed to do that? Prepare the pipe. Tracking flares. Okay. Because the quest is spawned in the original sector. The quest is spawned in the original sector. I don't know what that means. The original... which original sector? A Dumbledore, sir. Oh, he's got a artillery too. That quest is spawned in the original sector that you immediately leave. Let's see if you can find Jerry before you have to go to the augmented sector. Okay. Oh, oh, because the quest spawned in the next sector. Okay, I, I, I know what you mean now. Let's do a, um, let's do another delay. That might give us a chance to find the Jerry quest before the before this. So basically, the the Jerry thing I could find as long as I get get it before here, right? Because then you could go to Jerry after augmented. Okay. Yeah, the Jerry is another sector. Man, it's gonna be hard to power everything. That's for sure, man. 8 power drone control, 6 power weapons. Level 4 artillery. And then Jerry gets vented over and over. Yay! <laughs> if I can have double offensive drones here until my shields are down, then I can power my shields, I guess. There's an unlock if you get the true ending boss with Jerry. Is there? Okay. Oh, this is it. This is the uh, this is the Jerry quest, right? Jerome, continue listening. Uh. So, does it matter which I do, or do I have to politely ask for the coordinates? I'm, gonna, I'm just going to ask chat, because I want to do these right, since they're so random to get these. Does either one work? I can force out of them? Okay. You'll need them to surrender. Let's go. I have plenty of drone parts. Let's do this. So we need to accept the surrender.
All right. You want to surrender or what? Surrender, bro. By the way, you need the crew kill a transport ship in Jerry's sector. Okay. Okay, all right, beautiful. So that gave me the coordinates to the Jerry sector, which means I can now... You're gonna have to tell me the order of this because I don't know with all these extra quests and sectors exact best way to do it. I can still get a bunch of jumps before the quest though, I think. One, two, three, four, five. Do augmented first, then Jerry, okay. Remember the time you lost your training on Zoltan A? Because you turned O2 off and didn't pause when you went to eat dinner. Okay. Yeah, tracking flares. This is using my fuel though, but. I still, I like the tracking flares. Yeah, I can gather as much scrap as I possibly can. Get blasted. Damn, no double reward there. One, two, three, four, five. If I lose a jump, I, I should be careful about not getting too greedy. Okay. Uh, he's running and he's got track and he's got cloaking, so we use tracking flares again. Man, every ship with cloaking means we have to use double fuel to for that jump, basically. Wow, look at that weapon system. Holy shnikes. Hack your piling to make sure. Damn it. Nice. All right, accept them onto my ship. <laughs> okay. I've given you rebels a chance twice. And you've killed, I think, Monsvik both times. Poor Monsvik over here. How does he get killed by a human? Like, seriously, how are you getting assassinated by this rebel? I should probably read it, but I don't understand quite how that's working. You never accept rebels? Well, I have clone base. So there's no downside. There's no downside to it. <laughs> Even if he'd be vented over and over, that's only an upside to me. Trying to decide how, how I go about my upgrades. I think it is just power as much as I can. Multiverse jumping in, okay. No cloaking at least, that's nice. Whew. Four shields, Zoltan shield. If I wasn't so OP, I'd be more afraid of these enemies. Thankfully, I am super OP. God, they keep shooting one of my drones. Stop killing my drone parts. Kill him. You're dead. You gotta go, Chris Doodle, right? Thanks for hanging out, my friend. We'll see you later. At least augmenteds will help with my power issues a bit. That's true. They do have power, don't they? That would be really nice. All right, so how greedy do I go? Licking one, two, three. That gives me one escape or double jump protections worth. I have literally the max power I can get from just my systems. Backup battery is the only power for up, uh, upgrade I can do for power, or the lab upgrade for this guy, or other crew that give me power. Attempt to download. Nice. 
All right, well, we're not getting the dynasty one, whatever that one is. I could get the store. I think the store would be safe. This quest is going to lead me to another sector, correct? Uh, if he gives me... You know what? Sorry. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm killing him. Sorry, bro. Sorry. What are you doing? Why would you do this? Oh my god, we're just a... We're on the same side. I am on the side of the ancients. The ancients need all of your stuff. Yes! Yes, now that... You, you know how to deal, sir. You monster! <laughs> Why would you do this? Oh my god. That's, uh, I just wanted... I don't, all you have to do is give me that laser. Been fine. Do you ever stop and consider by the time a lot of these ships surrender, they'd be falling apart and be unrepaired and would inevitably die anyway? See what they're offering. And we can do our salvage mission. All right, four fuels, not bad. Bunch of humans. Maintenance drone. Don't really have a slot for that. We do this because you're so rich. Give me your stuff. Yeah, can't get three of these guys. Can't get level nine. Uh... Drone control. Besides, that would be more power, and the Harbinger drone, I think, is better than the Combat 2, anyway. What is this? One power for two shots. That wouldn't be better than our Chain Flak, right? Two power for three shots. Only thing I'd want would be another weapon. Well, probably, you know, go, do, going into this ancient sector, we might get another OP Harbinger weapon, which would be awesome. Harbingers plus Combat 2s are quite complementary. Combat 2 for shield suppression, Harbingers go to town, yeah. Alright, I don't think I want anything here. All I want really would be crew that don't get dented, so... Alright, here we go. Okay. Contact the Lanius. No verbal response. Uh, apologies. Damage. Not wanting to take airlocks. You call me assuming question have. Show him a robot. Uh, agree to let him to assist the FTL drive. Okay. Crunch me. All right, ancient recovery site. All right. Here's the alien. Found live one most mysterious. Okay, so this is the one where we wanted to keep a drone to feed to the augmented girl, right? Uh, ancient tech to offer, right? You call flack on the Lanius. What? Um, what is this? It's probably worth getting this crew, right? What is the payload teleporter? It's a better bomb. If you will fight them, they'll offer surrender with ancient stuff. Okay. They're the ones who slowly die from damage. Okay. All right. Let's, uh, let's try to get free stuff then. Despite the friendliest, you've decided to attack them. <laughs> You're friendly. Now die. Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Oh my god. Aren't they aren't they immune to venting? This guy's an augmented. He's immune to venting. But I won't have to res them a lot. I don't know what you're talking about. There we go. Till they take damage and they vent themselves, right. Why am I putting him on sensors? Uh, oh yeah, he can power stuff, can't he? Okay, wow, well there's our second Harbringer Mark 1. 
Okay. Uh, do you have any... Oh, you have weapon training. Okay. Then we could put this guy on sensors. Nice. All right. You know what? I think I might like two Harbringer ones plus a combat two because of lower power. Due to laziness, our hole has 80, 58 breaches. That's right. Okay. So we're supposed to offer up... Is this the one where there are three ruins? Alright, fight the Lanius. Don't need tracking flares here. Three ruins for the Augmented Cruiser, which we already did, but it, it gives us the free, like, drone part things, right? I don't need the ruins for the true ending, though. Okay. I'm probably strong enough that I can do it anyway. I'm gonna one-shot almost everybody here. Do, 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 do. Okay. So. I can do that. I triple, 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 triple offensive drones. One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah. Okay, fight the Lanius. My ship dangerous. You wanting not to mess with. I would love to mess with it, actually. Tracking flares. Triple offensive drones. Woo! That's a big old flak. Nice. This guy. Our drones are getting through by themselves. That's a good sign. Decoy buoys. Must have Dalton's tail bypass. Okay, another augment that I can't do anything with. All right, so as long as we do any damage to this guy, he will start to slowly lose health. If I'm not mistaken. Right, so I do that. No, no, you're dead. Mrs. Booga! <laughs> Welcome aboard, Mrs. Booga. Is there a Mr. Booga? Or would you like to have coffee sometime? Ow! Bro, though! Oh, yeah, I used this ability heal, I forgot. <laughs> Mrs. Booga, do you have a sister? <laughs> uh. You don't just cherry tap, you want to do some damage. What? You just cherry tap. You want to be the Lanius Vega. Sorry, yeah, I think you asked that, didn't you? I, the way you said it, it was a little old. Sorry. Vega... I two eight. There you go. Welcome aboard, Vega. You are the best weapons augmented ever seen. Oh, was that free hit damage too? Whoops. Uh, what's the... Minus plus there. Ah, oh, Crystal Elites. You can totally be the Clone Bay Plunder Pig. As a run where you can only use ancient weapons and drones with this ship. We almost have that. You would lay a trap here, so ignore and lay a trap. I'm down with that. Um... Let me do... This. I want the extra power, so I'm gonna do that. And then... The Lanius. Oxygen drink speed is quartered. Is there another thing? For them to get... More power? No, okay. More jumps equals more ancient loot. Yeah. 
Okay, uh, so we want to do task trap. Okay. So now this guy needs to be in auto mode. <laughs> I'm just going to repair that. Okay, it's fine. He should still go to the shield room, I think. That's that's kind of annoying that he's got to be in auto mode to get the powers. That's definitely a trade-off. If I if I turn this off, we lose the power. Yeah. Okay. But I think the power's worth. All right. So we do need to find the ruins. We know the ruins aren't down there. Let's check. All right, fight the Lanius. Man, these ships, the augmented ships really look cool. All right, tracking flares. Using all my darn fuel and power. Oh, this guy's got a, looks like he's got a eradicator like I do. The background's on the sector map, so good too. I don't know if I noticed that. <laughs> I am feeling strong. I don't know if we're strong enough for Sylvan, but my god, feel strong. Oh, this. Yeah, that is cool. All right, ruins. All right, aftermath of terribly damaged and brutal war. Brutally torn apart mega class carrier ship. Okay, attack. Thankfully, we don't have to use tracking flares. Um, I feel like we're gonna be able to close to one shot most of these guys. I'm gonna go ahead and hack the piling just to make sure. I clicked off the screen, and what did I just click on? Freaking OBS. The hell? Okay. All right, hope I didn't mess up anything there. Freaking beams, man. Okay, get one shot. You'd probably skip Sylvan if I manage to get Jerry. Your main concern is if I F up the crew kill, though. Shouldn't be hard if I'm careful. Okay. That is an upgrade to the flak. Bam, baby. We are almost full ancient build, man. So that was, uh, that's one extra shot over the chain flak, right? Because that's three shots and that's four shots. Beautiful. Jerry's scary. The crew kill for the ship I need to crew kill for Jerry, by the way. Okay. Gotcha. All right, so we're looking for ruins. Sylvia, don't really crew kill. Extra shot plus much higher damage output of targeting hull. Yeah. Salvage the wreckage. Intruders on board. Oh, no, again. Oh, no. What's what? Rockmen Crusaders. 225 health. Wow. Okay. Why do I have less power than I feel like I should? Well, hopefully they can be vented, Rockman Crusaders. Looks like we're winning this fight. Alright, I need to control you. Move you, move you, move you. These Rockland Crusaders are tanky as schniggly punk. Uh, Crusaders are fun when you get them, but they almost ended your brother's run. 
This exact ship dropped us to two crew on one ship. Yikes. Uh, they start dying as well once you damage them. Who, the rock dudes? Only problem with relying on the cognitive power, it's going to move wherever you get bored or damaged or whatever. Yeah, yeah. So every ruins is just extra loot, so it's still worth looking for them. Definitely want the store. Schniggly punk, how dare you? <laughs> what? I'm just talking about shooting me, punk. Um, so do I want to delay some more? I probably want to delay some more to find all the ruins. I always could do salvage mission. Let's go ahead and lay the trap again. Particle beam, particle beam, particle beam. Does anything that a particle beam? Um. Yeah, I can't really upgrade them unless we get better versions of any of these weapons, I think. I don't think we're gonna find anything better than those. So does anointed? Okay, there's ruins. Does anointed? Um, that's the exit beacon, right? So if I ru want ruins, I need to go to them before that. Imagine getting harbor mark two to these weapon, to these two harbinger mark ones though. Need to feed our ancient stuff. Go ruins before anointed. Yeah, but there's a third one, and I'm trying to decide if I need to go down here to see if there's a ruins here. That's what I'm just debating. Because the ruin, the third ruins could be here, 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 or here. Is there anything else I want to do this store? I could get more crew. We get the anointed girl if we, what, attack her and then feed her? I have to feed her an ancient tech though, right? So I need to get some drone I don't care about to feed her. I think that's how that works. Attack. It's a peaceful NG way. Oh. I need um, drone. Uh, I need defense scrambler. That's what I need to do at the next empty jump I get. I need to get defense scrambler. Completely forgot. Bam. Ancient Mender, there we go. That's what we can use. Oh, the luxury scrap. We can use that as the thing we feed. You don't have to feed her for the quest, it's just if you want the anointed as crew. I do want the anointed as crew. So that's the that's like the second part of the quest, I think. You can feed her like afterwards or something. Alright, good. There's the other ruins, so I don't even have to miss out on anything. Perfect. You can get her twice? You can get her three times? What? One, two, three, four, five, six. Man, I get a lot of jumps here. Uh, how do I do it, though? <laughs> it's buggy. It'll be fixed in 5.0. Okay. Is chair blocking the exit beacon? No, the anointed is the exit beacon. I'm gonna go one, two, back to the store and get fuel. Anointed is the exit beacon, yeah. Okay. Oh, you got one of those drones now, eh? Get blasted. That was a Harbinger Drone Mark II. Okay, well then I'm glad I didn't let it through. Oh my god, free borders. Doop, doop, scoop, doop, doop, scoop, not, oh. <laughs> Don't you go there. I have to control you to not go there. So this is gonna do free hull damage when he uses his ability. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't use it since I guess he wasn't in his system room. Okay, nice. No, don't go to piloting. Bro. Bro. You can't power piloting. Go to shields. There it is. Planius music so OP, never nerf. That's right. It's all the power I can get, man. It needs time to charge. If you kill the augmented fast, they won't pop. Okay. Um, scan show ghosts have taken control of the ship. Well, now that's interesting. Attack them for some value. Maybe they will offer to trade. Can I actually buy ancient stuff off of these guys? Ghost. Oh, no, it's a ghost. Um, or can I maybe get them to surrender to offer me something? I encounter a royal harbinger drone. Don't let it hit. Okay. They want to trade for fuel. Hmm. Let's attack. Just always attack. Spatchers, 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 spatchers. Mushroom, mushroom, snake. Oh no, it's a snake. What? That is that is a terrifying weapon. I forget what that does, but that is terrifying. Terrifying. We do not want to be hit by that. Okay. Woo! Okay. Defense technology fires at any incoming projectile. So that's... Is that better than the defense drone I had earlier? Reload is a lower MS, so I think it's actually just slightly worse defense drone. I think I can sell that because I have the mender to give to the girl for the quest. Oh, the lower the better. Okay. Recharge would be lower time. My bad. Yes, math. Stuff. This is better than defense and more consistent. Okay. Well, it sells for more, so I'm keeping that to give away. Um, so how many crew slots do I have? I have four more. So if we get the girl from this, and then we get that special ancient guy, that's two crew. And if we get, what's his face, the human, Jerry, that's three crew. So I do, technically, I think I have slot for one more crew if I wanted to. I have four slots. And I think there's three quest crew I have the chance to get. So I'm thinking about getting crystal crew. Crystal gets vented. That's fine, we have clone bay. I, I, isn't there... I thought somebody said there was an upgrade, though, that crystals could not be vented. I can get the lab for crystal. Okay. Alright, let me let me get this guy. He's gonna get vented for now. Sorry, bro. I'm gonna have him hang out. I'm gonna actually have him hang out in the weapons room so that he can lock it down to keep guys from coming in here. Eventually. So one, two, th oh, I wanted to buy fuel here, actually. I'm hoping at the store I can do the augment thing. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll try to. I need, I need an empty jump, of course. There we go, perfect. Onboard lab, crystal, crystallized hydrogen. Perfect. All right, I feel like there's something else I wanted to do here. Yes. Um, defense scrambler we need to do. Go. And then we could start sending, spending stuff on all the weapon upgrades. The performance upgrade. I'm going to do one of those. I don't want to use up all my missiles because we might need more delays later. And then let's do the um, let's do the salvage now. Two whole fuel, yay! Yeah, it might be worth buying missiles, honestly, for the upgrades. Um, so I do need one tech to feed the girl. Is, is that correct? I, it does get rid of one of the things to get that girl. 
let's analyze. Pinpoint eight seconds, beam length of two. It's a crew killing thing, yeah, I don't, uh, my weapons are insane. I need to feed Mender to anoint it. Okay, cool. Uh, I can go one, two, one, two, three, four. Okay. You need to give her two if you want two anointed. If if getting two is um doing some sort of weird exploit, I don't want to do that. Am I able to get Jerry? I need a crew kill for that, right? I could probably kill just by putting breaches everywhere and killing O2. That's that's kind of what I'm thinking about if I need to do a crew kill. Um Yeah, it's an exploit. Yeah, I don't I don't want to do that. I have these other ruins. Um Help augmented help the elites. I think I want to help the Augmented. They're the Lanius. Who are the Elites? Oh. These are normal Lanius, I guess. Oh, I don't need to do that anymore. Nice. Thing is, you need crew kill while the ship tries to escape. Well, I could, like, hack piloting. I mean, Eradicator Beam, I feel like, is my way to do it. If we put, I don't know, I don't, I don't remember the Jerry fight since I've only done it once or whatever, but I'm going to be able to like destroy all their systems and breach everything, right? Hey, all right. Well, that's going to be probably put us over the top for crew, but it's extra power, right? What's up, Miss Nin? Maybe hack pilot breach O2, breach medical and breach piloting. Yeah. It's not a boss, need a crew kill, it's just a random transport ship. Okay. Alright, ruins and then the anointed. Okay, attack. No cloaking. Alright. I'm a little afraid of that thing, so. It's going to depend on what the transport rolls. Also, at the end of the it gives you something like a fire beam. Okay. Alright, Ancient Director. Cool. This is one that can... Oh, this guy can power too. But it requires a drone slot, and I don't have drone slots, so. Alright. Do I want anything else before we do this fight? I should probably go ahead and get the fourth shield. Maybe even like artillery upgrade. It's four power. Wow, four power to occupied room. Wow, that is insane. Yeah, it's a net plus two since he basically takes up power for our drone. I, I think I'd rather just have um, the three offensive drones. We're like one shot dudes with this build. Okay. Cool looking ship. Um, what do you intend to use it for? I'm gonna let this creature get eat, uh, eat another living being. Hold firm. Okay. Tracking flares. Do I, need, I don't need to crew kill her, right? We just need to force a... Force a... Surrender. Cool. So, which we should do on, like, a single volley, I believe. There we go. 
Energy Stunner. Okay. Also for the Jerry, transport artillery can be situationally good. Just can't aim it. I need another augment slot for the true ending. I can get rid of long-range scanners. All right, let's do this. Okay. Oh, damn it, man. Yeah. I, so I gotta lose long-range scanners for this. Offer to take her with me. Offer her an ancient mender. Which one? Yeah, mender. Hey, Hollow with the raid. Welcome, Hollow Raiders. All right. So we gotta lose our long range scanners, sadly. But they've given us good value. All right. Beautiful. It's probably a Yeet Scanners, which isn't great for finding the beacon you need in Jerry's sector. Oh. Uh, I mean, I can get rid of tracking flares. But those are just so good. Yeah, I don't understand why this is an augment. I, I, honestly, there's probably two big things I think multiverse needs to change. One is they need to do something about all the extra junk they give you with limited augmentation slots and stores needing to be rerolled. Those are, I think, the two major things that I think hyperspace and multiverse needs to update. If the transport rolls clo cloaking for the final bosses, yeah, the tracking flares is too good. I think I think you're right. Yeah, augment storage is the biggest thing. It's just it's just too um, uh, limited by vanilla FTL. Well, welcome Hollow and welcome Hollow Raiders. I appreciate it. You, are, you folks are joining at the perfect time. We're trying to get the the final ending for real this time. So we're supposed to jump to Jerome Protectorate now, right? Is that correct? Jerome next. Okay. All right. MFK Aces. Okay. You visit one of the boss friends, state your business. Uh, don't kill too many unforced fights. I think hyperspace should make a vanilla version with ascension level limitations like Slay the Spire. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Alright. So I don't want to tell him I'm killing him, right? Okay, yeah, sure. Say hello to the boss for me. Okay. From what you recall, if people don't try to attack you first, then don't kill them. I should crew kill for their goods. Okay. So what am I looking for for Jerry? Is it Distress Beacon or what? What am I looking for? I'm looking for an empty beacon. Thank you for the follow. Okay. Ostrich Senpai, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Love the name. Rebel Rigor, Rigor. I should spam mines, okay. Cloaking. Uh, I want to go to the stores, but there was an empty beacon above. Well, empty from what I can tell. You know, the problem is I don't have long range scanners, so I don't know if it's an empty beacon anymore. This is a cool track. Yeah. So should I be accepting surrenders or is that not gonna matter for this kind of stuff? Could turn a lot of unforced fights and delay a trap. Yeah, I don't have long range scanners. I just gotta check all the beacons, I think. Just kill, okay. Yeah, I think I just check every single thing and I like avoid stores, even though I want to go to store to sell stuff. 
Oh, I forgot I have this girl too. Which... You are trained in fighting. Ha! <laughs> She's the one that loses health if we're in fights, so... Um, does this give me power? Yes, it does. Okay. She gives me two power. Frickin' nice. Okay. Okay. Auto assault. Okay, so if I keep my distance, I should be able to delay, right? Nice. Okay. Try to awaken the alien. Do I have to do this now? I could have approached for delay. Uh, I don't want to take the chance. No, I do that sector aid. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Uh, so we're gonna do, uh, lay the trap. I wanna do, um, I'm gonna do one weapon upgrade here. Uh, I better save my missiles, actually. Wish I had more missiles. Never thought I'd say that, did ya? Lay a trap. Yeah, I think I need to save the ammo. I love missiles! <laughs> no, it's not, no! No, I don't! Alright. Avoid provoking for more delay. I'm gonna do every delay I can. Give us as much time as possible. If you approach, you hack the station for one delay plus map. I don't think that's guaranteed, Kieran. I'm pretty sure what you're saying is a chance to happen, not guaranteed. Because it could just be an immediate fight. I'm pretty sure that's a vanilla event that could be just an immediate fight, so... Guaranteed... I beg to differ. I feel like that's not true. No surrender. Chance for a map is better than jumping blind. <laughs> I like guarantees in my game, and guaranteeing I get extra jumps, I think, is more valuable than potential for a map. Right, I'm gonna go to the store, see if it actually is a store. Let's see if I can buy missiles. Try and dock despite having aliens aboard. Speak to no one about this, okay. Alright, I'm gonna sell this. Is there any reason to keep this anymore? I can sell this, right? Defense 3, yeah. We're gonna buy some missiles, that's for sure. Four whole missiles. And if I do that, I go to the store, I should be guaranteed another delay, if I'm not mistaken. Sell flares for lasers, lol. Defense 3 is nuts, I'm sure it is, but I'm going for all-out all offense. Do you think it's worth doing this instead of my all-out offense? Is this the one that's like insane against, um... What's-his-face? Uh, Sylvan? Kieran thinks it sucks. You tried it a few times. I mean, I have cloaking. I'm probably gonna maybe go for like level 3 cloaking and... Can you do that and the cloak, um, we stealth weapons? One thing you think the Jerry True ending unlock will get reset in 5.0? Well, yeah, I'm re-unlocking with a command, if that's the case. It's good because it snipes boarding drones. Well, we're not probably going to do the real... What's-his-face? The real Sylvan, right? I don't think we'll have a chance. With the True ending, I don't think I get a chance for the real Sylvan. If you save him or whatever. I'm just gonna keep the offensive drones. I like I like what we have. I think the only thing I do is upgrade what we have. Uh, if I if I ignore, I should be able to do this. Good. Trap. Okay. All the delays. I can kill Sylvan Sector 8 and then go to the Ancient Sector? Okay, maybe I will try that. 
kind of need the missiles. I'll do that. I should have bought fuel at that store. Okay, protect them. Oh, it's this. Okay. Huh. Well, triple offensive drones should be easy mode on this, right? They don't have the time queue thing on this guy yet. Yeah, we protected you. Yay! All right. Hey, thanks for the fuel, actually. It's really nice. Man, so many jumps. Uh, hail them and ask if they can assist. Or I ignore to get more delay, right? Defense through can keep up with three spun up Vulcans. Wow. Is that true? I think I ignore... I think I ignore just for every chance I get to do the delay. You've unlocked every ship and you can't wait for version 5.0. Okay. This could give us a map, right? Yeah. I think they had a chance at a map. Don't jump to the X until I found the transport, okay. This is an interesting floor layout here. Um, the surrender of one fuel. That won't give me a map, right? That's like the worst surrender deal I've ever seen. Refuse. Alright, salvage extra ammunition. Nice, extra missiles. Beautiful. <clears throat> Just refuse and take their stuff. That's what I like to hear. Engineer carry ship. To Jerry from Smith and the Gang. Is this it? You said transport, but it's not this event? Okay. Let's ask him what this is. Engineers don't seem to recognize you as Federation ship or just don't care. This is my magnum opus, an auto ship program with Jerry's personality. It just needs some finishing touches. Tell me, what's your favorite thing about the boss? Ha 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 ha. Uh... His ruthless and unforgiving nature makes him a good soldier. His authoritarian manner of ruling over people, he's the kind of strong leader this galaxy needs. He's cool, I guess. <laughs> uh, he's cool. Indeed he is! There's no one cooler. Perhaps I have not yet modeled this AI personality to match Jerry's personality enough yet. I must get back to work. Take this before you go. To the Rebellion! Rebellion! Thanks. <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right. I think if you kill him, Jerry will attack you. Okay. All right, looking for just empty jumps to delay or the whatever the transport is. A circus? Well, if I ignore, I think I can do another delay. Is this Is this event useful? I feel like I did this one before. Isn't this just like buying some special crew? Yeah, I think it's the buy crew that I've seen. So I'm gonna ignore and do the delay. There's the last delay we can do. Well, we've got so much value out of this mine layer, that's for sure. <sighs> this layout. I'm gonna have to go to the exit if it's not up here. Craft advanced FTL navigation. Okay. All right. If I can, I might not have enough missiles if it takes missiles or fuel. Okay. So I could take fuel for drone parts here or missiles for drone parts. This is actually kind of nice. 
If I reject, that would be an empty jump, though, right? Yeah, I don't get I don't get the, the empty jump thing. Uh, MV Colonizer. We found you. Wait, is this Jerry Sector? Damn it, now you've done it. If you've done anything to Jerry, I swear, it'll be the end of you. I'm gonna kill you either way. You get the idea. All right, so this is a multiverse fight. No cloaking. Okay. Damn, this looked like a special ship for a second there. I thought we found Jerry. Or whatever we're looking for here. Wow, this track is crazy sounding. They really do love their Jerry here in Rebel Land. Top right is Force Fight, then you have to really go around. Yeah. Well, we're checking it. There's a chance that this is the jump we're looking for anyway, right? Rebel Fighter. You know who I am? Not particularly. I am Tom, the true protector of the sector. That naive idiot has no idea how the rebellion works. He's only in charge. Okay. So, it looks like I don't get it. I don't have advanced FTL navigator. Oh, wait. This, no, this is not a do nothing where it lets me do some stuff, right? Yeah, I lose chance for Jerry. Well, it looks like I just lost it, so... Uh, oh well. We should at least still get the true ending. Yeah, go kill Sylvan instead. Honestly, I feel like there needs to be more opportunities for you to do the... The free... The do stuff on your ship stuff. Uh, I think I only have five jumps. One, two, three, four. Maybe if I get another delay somewhere. Let's face him. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, there's no way. Isn't there a hyperspace bay that does that? And there's, there's just no Jerry. I can't do Jerry. Is the exit forced? I mean, it's forced if I want the whole Jerry thing. If if empty beacons let you do stuff on your ship, I think that needs to be a change. Even if it's just reduced, so you can't do like, I don't know, the other special stuff like delays or whatever. I think jumping back to an empty beacon should let you work on your ship. I think that should be in multiverse. With so much stupid stuff you have to do in this game, they need to give you more op opportunities to do it. That's what you're talking about? Alright, I've arrived at the sector exit. It says Jerry's bomber. She to hail from an average looking human with a large pair of spectacles and oversized commander's uniform. This is Commander Jerry speaking. You're uh, you're on the Federation ship. Oh man, Vance told me you might come here and I cannot disappoint. I'm sorry. I had to defeat you or I guess you could leave. Vance probably wouldn't hear about it. He leaves on the last thought as though uncertain whether he should fight you. There's a way to cheese it? I mean, if it's an unlock, I'll cheese it. Because of mechanics of multiverse being so restrictive, I would cheese it if I can. How could I cheese it? Because this isn't what I was supposed to crew kill, right? You should have mentioned FTL navigation earlier. Eh. You think the cheese doesn't work? It's not an unlock. You think the cheese may be more of an exploit? Uh, well, let's just fight him, whatever. All right, his ship is pretty weak. I think we could actually take no damage. This may work for the same for the anointed. It's this Jerry here, Matt, Jorlak. All right, so is there a cheese I can do here? 
I should probably turn this off if I want to... I don't, I don't know what it would involve. Does it involve crew killing or what? You're gonna have to tell me because I have no clue. I'm just gonna sit here because he can't do anything to me. If the fleet overtakes the beacon, you think you could do the fleet exploit based on the code? On the code. Have to encounter Jerry again. You're not 100% sure. Um... I mean, if I go one, two, three, I could come back, right? Or does it have to do with diving this? So it sounds like it involves jumping away, is that right? Find transport and then dive exit. Okay. I'll jump away. Colonizer. You tried that for Jerry and it didn't work. Jump away and come back when overtaken by transport. Okay. I'll give it a try. I mean, I don't think we're, we're so strong that I don't mind taking extra dive for chances of things. I don't even have enough missiles to do another delay if I wanted to do that. Space him. Man, apparently, Jerry, I've checked every jump except the bottom right three. So I think I've just gotten screwed by RNG here. Which is not surprising. Happens to me every time I play multiverse. Screwed by quest placements and stuff. Oh, I'll, I'll still go for it. I'm hoping I can still make... Um, the uh, jump back things, what are those called? Uh, the advanced FTL navigation, because then I could jump directly to the exit beacon. You surrender. Okay. I could blow these machines up all day. I could do this all day, sir. So I can get all three of these jumps. If one of them give me, uh, one of them gives me an empty jump before I can make that, we can just direct jump, jump directly back there. You updated your ship pack, nice Vega. All right, there we go. We can finally make. What is it? It's engines, right? No, long range jump. Is it this? Is that what it is? Long range jump? Definitely not advanced FTL navigation, but I'm gonna assume that's right. Okay. Does that only let you jump twice? I can't do the lay a trap. I can actually. How does how does a long range jump in this work? Is it just where you can't jump anywhere for one fuel? You can you have it costs extra fuel for each place. Why do I need to delay? Didn't I have two more jumps and then I could just jump back to the exit beacon? Or does long range jump work different here? It's just FTL navigation. Okay. Is that how is that how it works? I don't know why I need to delay here. Is what I'm asking. It's not a double dive. Okay, I don't think I need to use the delay. I think I can actually do my salvage mission here. Yeah, I think I can just jump here. I think, but I don't want to click on it. I guess we're going to find out if I'm like triple diving or not. It did say allow you to jump to previous visit of beacons. Okay. Apparently it's the last one because... The, oh wait, demand the surrender of their goods. This is it. Okay, this is it. Okay. So I need to crew kill this, correct? Okay. And he's running away. 
So, how do we do this? He's got one, two, three, four, five crew. Hack piloting. Um, I need to turn off the artillery. How much damage does this do? So it's halberd beam. Yeah, maybe I do need this. Does this pierce all shields? Maybe I need that to attack once. Let me see what the artillery does before I fire. Okay, killed piloting. Okay, so I need to pull the pilot. I need to kill the O2 and I need the pilot to come out. So I need to breach shields. I need to breach a bunch of stuff over here, I think. Okay, O2 is breached. I could potentially just double breach the piloting. That might be the way to go. This does, that would do four damage. You're right, I could have let them board. Okay. So double breach on piloting. Hopefully he'll get low enough that he'll try to run out. And we let him out. Fuel bay being back online would be bad. So hopefully he'll run out of there. Nice. I think we got it. GG. Okay. Uh, then I can turn this off so it doesn't kill them. Yeah, turn off artillery for sure. Uh, we took took one damage. It's okay. Now we still have to find out if diving, though. I, I don't know. We might we might still not be able to do it, but at least we'll get Jerry. Do we? Oh wait, no. We would have to have done this. We need to get the Jerry fight now. Which we don't know if that'll happen or not. If the dive doesn't work, I won't get Jerry. So that's what we're doing. We're basically sciencing this. Okay. Crew of the transport has been killed. You scrap the hull before moving on to inspect the contents. Open the cargo. You pry open the cargo bay doors, utterly confused by what's inside. Instead of weapons, you find several boxes of knitted sweaters, a few birthday cards, and some brightly colored balloons. There's nothing here worth bringing back the ship, but you decide to anyways. Did we just ruin Jerry's birthday? <laughs> we should have delayed to not dive. I have eight missiles. I could have only done one more delay, Vega. Um... So, actually, that might have been just enough. That might have been just enough. It works in 4.11, as far as you know. You looked at the XML. Well, we're still going to find out. You're right. Well, that was, that's, you're assuming, Vega, that we knew it was here. If it was here, that wouldn't have worked. Um, but let's see. What can we do here? Sensors. Let's get some value points. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna take the jump and then exit. As long as the um, advanced thing works correctly. <laughs> it's the circus again, right? Uh, ignore the circus to get something. 
You're using the power of hindsight. It is very powerful. Uh, we wouldn't have room for other crew anyway, right? Because we're if, if we get Jerry. So I'm going to ignore to do something here. Um, which would be to get... I feel like there's some other augments I can get upgraded, like uh, cloaking... Can you get cloaking three and stealth weapons? Actually, you know what I haven't looked at? Uh, Lanius. No, I did look at that. We already have one more augmented than we planned anyways. That's true. Yeah, we got one free. Weapon with seven missiles we could do. Yeah, um, let me see. Uh, internal upgrade. Cloaking. So we can only do one of these. Level 3 cloaking or the stealth weapons. Probably level 3 cloaking with these weapons is better. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. And then I can do one more performance upgrade. Let's do that. And then... We've already done our salvage. Okay, so I think that's the last thing we can do. I talk to my special crew, the Anointed. Talk to them. Okay. I already... <coughs> Excuse me. Probably know about this, but in a future hyperspace update, you'll be able to trigger the empty beacon events by jumping back to previous beacon. Okay. Yeah, that will be helpful. Here we go. Let's find out. So, this isn't Jerry. Was this supposed to be Jerry? You saw that in a sneak peek. Is there anything I'm supposed to do special, or did I not get it? Do I need to, like, jump away and come back, or what? This was supposed to be Jerry. So it doesn't work. Okay. Alright, well, we missed out on Jerry. Sad times. Matt Jam said he said check the XML, but maybe it's because I attacked him and left. I don't know. I don't know. Level three cloaking should last long enough. Never Jerome, never. Poor Jerome, all he ever wanted was his birthday party that we ruined. What do you know, another quest we try to do, we get screwed out of because of the way Multiverse is put together. All right. Don't get Jerry, which was apparently something with an unlock with the true ending, so... Bad RNG. There's just there's just too much crap in multiverse. There's just too much crap. Thoughts on the sector music at the start? I don't know what you mean. Okay, um... Let's go to the sector map. And let's go ahead and do our... Salvage. Melt down some mines for scrap, okay. The Jerry music. Was there Jerry music? I don't remember. There's so much different and new music, I just don't remember. We can go for, um... Wait. How do we get the true... I need an empty jump to open the crate now, is that right? Did I miss something? It's it's the alien thing, right? Okay. Well, do I go for fighting the merchant then? Because I could potentially go one, two, three, and then repair. I can do that base or repair. Should be able to get to the base before the boss. No missiles for a defense drone, or defense drone is a no-no for Sylvan for you. Well, um, 
We have tracking flares. And we have Zeldon Shield. We have level 3 cloaking. We have hacking. And we have triple offensive drones and some really good weapons. Um, so... I don't know. What do you all think? Is this... Every time I try it, I've not been strong enough. This is by far, I think, the strongest build I've ever had. All I would get for it would be no unlocks, right? My anti-boarding is Zoltan, is Zoltan Shield plus level 3 hacking. Or level 3 cloaking is what my uh, anti-boarding is. Yeah, you can jump from the base and back to the base. I'm going to head that direction. I'll decide. I feel like we have a chance. Are we worthy? Yeah, thanks for nothing. I think the uh, defense three from the shop really would have been useful. Yeah, maybe so. Okay. So this would be where I would do this, but I want to check merchant first. So is there anything else I can do? I can't do this last thing with only two missiles. Okay, uh, help me remember. I feel like there was something else I wanted for if I do Sylvan. It's the breach uh, repair, but that doesn't matter for us. Well, it kind of does because our system's dying. So the breach repair. Home Bay 4. I don't have enough for that. 165 scrap. Shield upgrades. We do have the, the augment that makes our shields recharge faster, too. So those might stack. Um, I'm actually thinking about the breach sealant. How much do the shield upgrades cost? 40 scrap per. I could get three of these. He doesn't have any ions, it's just the six burst laser twos. Zoltan Shield Bypass to hack early. Zoltan Shield Bypass doesn't work with hacking, and I already have the defense drone stop thing. Yeah, hack still runs into the Zoltan Shield. Um, I'm, I'm thinking of the breach not because I care about my ship being breached for O2, I'm thinking about if they hit a system and it gets breached. I want to be able to repair that system even with dudes inside the room, so... I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do... Shield upgrade. And another shield upgrade. I can't get clone 4. It cost 165 scrap. I, I had 130, so it's not possible. Sadly. I'm just gonna do as many of the shield upgrades as I can do, so... Alright. I uh, already did that. Okay, so here we go. We can go here, and if merchant doesn't uh, repair doesn't get taken over, we can jump there for the thing after. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I can have. I want to cloak three his first volley, and I want all of my offense on immediately. What's up, Wambamboli? Wambambola. Here we go. Every time I try this, I regret it or run away or both. We're going for it again, man. Attack. Thanks for the free stuff. Do it. So we must have Zeldon Chill by a pass. We do have pretty good anti-boarding. I'm going to auto-fire these guys here. Crystal dude. Actually, NG stay over there. No, you guys are powering my shield, so I'm going to leave you in there. Okay, we dealt with the first borders pretty well. We're through the Zoltan shield. Cloak. Hack weapons. Uh, let's wait for the lasers to come by before we do the hack.
Damn it. Come on. So stupid. There, there, there. And then turn this off. And get our power back. Okay. So I don't have stealth weapons, so I want to use the entire cloak while this thing does some stuff. My Zoltan Shield, I can have it infinitely. Uh, I can have, what, my Zoltan Shield up infinitely, you think? Man, that's a lot of shields. Got it down to three. Level three hack. I think artillery might win it for us. It just needs to actually get the shields down. Hey, there we go. All right, we're getting breaches. So shields are down for now. Okay, we have cloak for the next volley. Look at this. Look at the drones doing the work. I should be shooting empty rooms with my Harmbringer, shouldn't I? Nice. GG cookie. I'm having a cookie time for that. Beat Sylvan, man. First time. Frickin' killed Sylvan. Did it. Frickin' did it, man. You got here just in time, Housers. The triple offensive drones. Artillery. Did it, man. I got a weapon twin that's better than any weapon I've had so far. Oh, really? Sylvan falls to his knees, bleeding profusely from a gash across his face. He manages to gasp out a few final words. Stranger, I hope this was worth it. Falls over. Traveling merchant is no more. Though a strong layer of slug sealant keeps the ship together as it begins to break. Eventually, it gives away under the stress and the ship explodes, scattering cargo containers across the system. Scrap the wreck first to find a signal disruptor, some map data, and a golden laser weapon unlike any you've ever seen before. The Rift Walker. Three fleet delay in the final sector where it does nothing. Oh my god. Two boxes of scrap. Oh my god, three boxes, four boxes, five boxes, six boxes, seven boxes, eight boxes, nine boxes, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen boxes of scrap. Ah, uh, four power. You greedy, murdering traitor, you. So this is basically an upgraded Vulcan with a max fire chance, huh? It's such a meme, you've seen it crash the game. Of course I did with the ancient ship. The rewards are insane. Yeah. Um, probably better than one of the Harbringers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. This with zero cooldown. Oh, okay. Well, I've seen modded weapons that do a similar thing. In our viewer ships. Uh, okay. Here we go. Riftwalker, Harbringer, Eradicator. Now I have all the scrap in the world to upgrade everything. Well, not the things that cost 9999. But yes, we can do this. So. I can literally upgrade everything. It's possible to upgrade, but I can't upgrade anymore because it requires empty jumps and the special stuff. Um, that's, that's kind of the thing, Osirst, that I think is another issue with, um, oh man, I can't even get the torch now. This, this needs to be fixed. I, this is the problem with multiverse having so much junk. Like, I literally can't even move this weapon behind it. How, how do you get the torch out? I do that. Okay. I don't know what sells for more.
Um, but still, there's just there's so much junk in the game. There's so much. There's there is what is what is the word? Bloat. Multiverse has bloat. And uh, I think that's the main issue I have with the mod. All right, but with the repair, we can actually still go to get the true end ending. So let's do that. More free stuff. And we do the try to awaken the alien. Alien. I go to the base too. Eh, no. Let's just go ahead and do this, just to make sure we can do it. Hello, Wither. Short story. Except. Isn't like 100 ships now or something crazy? Yeah. To be fair, they're working with what's available. Multiverse and hyperspace are separate developers from what I know. Oh, I understand. I'm just giving my feedback on what needs to be improved. And they're working on those things, which I'm happy about. One of the biggest things is, um, is uh, store randomness. And that's one of the things that's being changed, I think, in 5.0. Okay. Uh, are we fighting this guy? We are. Okay. You don't have cloaking? Okay. You do have cloaking, damn it. Why did I not see that system? Frick. Well, fine, I can do that too, bro. With the Riftwalker, with Raker, the tr true ending will be a breeze for me? Okay. I'll take your word for that. Yeah, hyperspace adds features that multiverse requests, yeah. Let's see how well this works here. Where's cloaking? Is this clo- where's the cloaking system? It must be in this room and he's like sitting on top of the... Whatchamacallit, the freaking. system icon. Yeah, he was... I literally couldn't see that it was Cloak because... because he was sitting on top of the icon. Alright. This is basically the Neon Cat, except... Uh, Neon Cat missile, except it's a laser, not a missile. Yeah, Cloaking is just for the charging the Rift Walker. Your mod has too much crap. Does not usually go down well with the... mod is made by people that think more is always better, which is the vast majority of modders. Well, I, I, I should... If it sounds, I don't mean to sound mean when I say there's too much crap, so I shouldn't say it that way. There's just, there's so much stuff in the game um, that... Uh, can become problematic to actually do all the stuff you want to do. These guys give me power. What can I get rid of? Too much stuff, not enough ways to store, sell, manage it. That's a good way to say it. Um, I guess, man, I don't want to get rid of Silly Device, but he is better than Silly Device. I'm sorry, Silly Device. Sorry. You have just morphed into your final form. You, know, This is the true final form of Silly Device. Silly Device 2. New and improved. Electric... Boogaloo. Okay. What's up, Kenny? And I mean, like, now... My ship is literally fully upgraded. And I can't do anything to it except at um, empty jumps. So there's no reason to do all these extra jumps. So I'm just gonna try to leave. I'm gonna try to just go directly to the exit. Because I can't spend my scrap on anything. There's no upgrades I can get. Yeah, we had, a, we had a raid by Hollow earlier, and when Hollow raids us, it's always awesome. And people apparently enjoy the multiverse, so... Good crew here. Thank you for being around, everybody. You're awesome. You're disappointed he's not sillier device, yeah. We can get a pre-igniter in stores, you think? I thought pre-igniter was only a special thing. So I guess we look for a store, and otherwise, we don't care. Uh, scrap the ship. Okay, tracking flares.
I don't even have cloaking up. Why don't I have cloaking up? I thought it was supposed to recharge. I guess I was... I don't know actually why that happened. That bomb is pretty scary, I'm pretty sure. Hey, uh, Vasily Bunkar, another gifted sub. Thank you, my friend. You were just doing all the subs today. I will say, Riftwalker's not great for cloaking. Did I, did I do the stealth weapons? No, I did level three cloaking, so. I don't think I have stealth weapons. There's other things in ancient stores? Okay, well I guess that's what we're looking for. Alright, we've got some stores we can check out. Um, that was sent as Sylvan died. Okay. Yeah, there is a delay on that stuff then. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for a bit. Sometimes you need all these shots to go off before uh, you jump for modded weapons like that to not completely crash. Yep, I killed Sylvan. Did it. I mean, we have a Rift Walker, or Rift, Rift Waker. It's zero damage, just perfect. But we had Cloaking, now I know. Cloaking plus Zoldan Shield and level 3 hacking means they never get to do anything to you, so that's how we were able to do it. Rescue the store. You have Cloaking. Whew. Get blasted. All right. Ancient ASB program platform. Holy Harbringer Drone Mark Two. Second Eradicator. Goodness. Drones move weird when the ship is extra small. Okay, what do we do here? Um, do I care about delays anymore? Are, are delays still a thing in this sector? I don't think so. Carnage is OP too. Three power, four damage, two system damage. 80% breach chance. Um, Harbinger 2. Oh, yeah, that's 8 power drone control. Okay, what's Plasma 1? Alright, alright, let's do that. I like that. So, triple Harbinger, all. Well, the only non uh, ancient thing we have is the Rift Waker. Do I want to lose the Harbinger for a second Eradicator? I'm gonna just sell. I guess there's no reason to sell it. Actually, I, I don't need the uh, this the uh, I don't need the scrap. Let's bring the drone part and fuel. Automatically repairs breaches, puts out fires, reduces suffocation, damage by fifty percent. Remarkable ammunition replication system and synthesized warhead for your missile weapon using leftover scrap. Missile weapons do not use ammo. Consumes fifty percent scrap from all sources. Okay, that's weird. Um, man, I kind of like the, the idea of double eradicator. Let's do it. That's that's a one. That's two power, right? Yeah. Rift if Rift Waker takes care of all shields, then eradicate everything. How does Gatling not immediately enter a cloaking? I'm not sure. Actually, it seemed like. Oh, it did. There, it did. Okay. So I need drone power is completely upgraded. Okay, I need eight power. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think we have that for all of our drones to be immediately online. Really, I just need things that give me more power. Um, I could dismiss some of my crew to get some of these guys just for power, and I think I might do that. Get rid of my. Um, 
who can I get rid of to do that? It would have to be a crystal dude, an ancient or the an or silly device. Um, because all I really care about is power now. Okay, sorry, Ares, you're great and all. I need power. So this person gives me power without me having to use their special ability, if I'm not mistaken. So if I go into, like, weapons, this will give me an extra power, is that right? Nice. Okay. Okay. Um, so I have a friend coming over to drop off something soon. In about 20 minutes, I'm gonna have to be AFK for a bit, so... I don't think we can finish this run in 20 minutes, so let's... Well, let's keep on going here. Our build's done. It's like mopping up all the enemies here. You have cloaking, so tracking flares. Okay. So we just cloak until our weapons are ready and then kill everybody. <laughs> That's the play. Eradicator 2. Pretty strong, man. We are pretty strong. Okay. Sounds good. No, it also sounds good. A never ending, uh, whatchamacallit? Rift Wager. Is it at this point is it even worth putting power on the artillery? Probably not. So. Against big fights, I guess. Probably should cloak that. Okay, that is weird. During... While I'm fighting... It acts like I do have stealth weapons. I feel like that weapon breaks the game somehow. Eradicator 2. Three damage, three system damage. Honestly, I feel like double eradicator one's better. I feel like double eradicator one is just better. Ancient missile drone. So I think I think we're just good. I think we go finish this. I think the zero cooldown is breaking the stealth detection. That could be it. Yeah, you might be right. Alright. You have cloaking. You don't have cloaking. So I can just go like this. When this thing's about to fire, we cloak that. I'm pretty sure this will be a zero damage fight. The scary thing is the artillery, so we're gonna fire at that, I think. Okay. Get one shot. Looking pretty good. Loot the cash. Eradicator Mark Three, though. Do I even get to equip it though? Because I feel like you're like forced into stuff here. Uh, okay, extra hyperspace. Okay, I'm just. Con yeah. Okay. All right, uh, tracking flares. I don't think we're forced right into fight after this. But I would like to see what the Eradicator 3 looks like. I think it's the first time I've seen that. All right, six shield ship here. Let's go ahead and hack those. Not that they're do anything versus our uh, Rift Walker once it's fully charged. Oh, I just hacked the pilot and that's not what I meant to do. Whoops. Well, good thing it doesn't matter then. Any amount of shields is not enough. Get blasted. Alright. Gun belt boat out of the way. What does an Eradicator 3 look like? 4 power, 34 second charge time. I mean, it's double this, but it's also like double the charge time. So without a pre-igniter, I just don't even think it's better. It's longer and slower. Giggity. 
Giggity, giggity, goo. So, we're just gonna keep the double eradicator one. I'm pretty sure it's just better. Yeah. Yeah, I need pre-igniter, which apparently is a thing that doesn't really exist in this game. Or at least, not without a very special thing that you get. We'll save it. I mean, we're looking for the store. Where's the store? Maybe the store can give us a pre-igniter. I don't know. How many Mark II weapons in this game are just worse than the Mark I? Yeah, well... I guess you're talking about even, um... Even vanilla, and that's... I would say that's kind of true, actually. Wow, that's some insane dodges. Does that thing pierce a shield? Ha! Huh. I was wondering why I wouldn't get rid of that last shield. This thing freaking shield pierces. No idea. All right. Stimulants. Increases their speed by 150%. That's not bad. It's probably the most useful thing I can get. Um, I don't see another store, so... I am going to sell this now. I'm going to get the stimulants, because my crew can be slow. Could be the downfall of them. Spoke of rehearsal later today. I don't have rehearsal today. It got cancelled. So we're good. Uh, flesh being dang, and I, or I require more, I, I, more creativity. Yeah, offer some insults. Um, regrettably, sentient meat, space meat. Yes, good. Thank you. All right, thanks for the scrap. That's basically meaningless now. Uh, how's the Rift Waker been doing for for you, huh? It's pretty OP. Pretty OP. It's basically broken. Like many of the things in this game. Basically broken. You kill that guy on sight. I don't have a reason to kill anybody else. <laughs> I'm honestly just trying to finish the run now and actually get the win. So I can get another run in today and not, you know, have to stream for eight hours. Did I know there's another version of the Rift Waker you can get from a quest line. No, I did not. Okay. So this is the um, special thing again. Investigate closer. Avenge Sylvan. Avenge him! Who would ever kill Sylvan? <laughs> not me. Man, who did it? Oh, God. Oh, who would ever kill Sylvan? I That... That person's so mean. I don't know who would ever do such a thing. Kill second merchant. This is this is a different merchant. This is not the same one. This is not the real Sylvan. This is not the Sylvan you're looking for. Okay. Uh, you tried to kill his ass second time. First was early sector, second was sector eight. Yeah, you you don't get it two ship fights. Okay, nothing we could do. Eradicator Mark three again. <laughs> but I just sold one though. All right. Yeah, they're like resistance systems or whatever. Uh, what are you doing? Fight the MFK Ace. Why not? Okay. Do do be bum bum be bum bum bum. Do 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 do. You're running, really? Let's 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 stop that. No running allowed. Must kill you. If I had the salt man, I could have gotten a second Rift Waker from a blue option there. And Scalco. All my people either give me power or are a silly device, so sorry, bro. That Eradicator of Mark III looks horrifying. Alright, let's do this. This is the fight that I think killed us last time. 
Uh, no, this is it's the one after this. So you do not have cloaking, so we don't need to use tracking flares. Oh, my cloaking's not up. What? Well, schnizzle punk. Okay. Yeah, solar flare. That was my bad. Okay. Alright. Uh, I should have hacked is something else, probably. But I think we're about to kill him. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. No big deal. Who is taking damage? F your sh face, man. Goddamn weapons hack. Alright, fine. We're just gonna cloak while our... While our guys do their thing. Okay, alright. Um... Okay, you're dead. Let's go deal with these guys. Okay. Okay. Uh, um, Ancient Royal, I think I need you. You give power? No. Okay, we're just gonna replace our pilot. Monsvik, sorry. What's their special ability? Not Monsvik, no! Alright, he should now go to shields. Perfect. Okay. He's died numerous times to rebel backstabbing, I know, right? Poor guy. That lore nuke, yeah, it's 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 overwhelming. That's why I'm skipping it all, because I read it once and my brain can't handle it. Alright, here we go. Tracking flares. This is the guy that killed us last time. Let's do it. Let's get our revenge. I'm gonna just power all this. Cloak it. See if we can one shot this guy. Enemy FTL charging. Why is this FTL charging? Uh, okay. Okay. Alright. Free intruders on board. GG. If only Lord Nukes were available to the player. GG, Ancient Cruiser Sloppy! Ha <laughs> ha! Beautiful. Triumphant jubilation as the flagship explodes. You've won this battle. But I thought it was over. All right, Lore Nuke again. As the MFK flagship is destroyed, advance with it. You know your mission has been a success. The rebellion will struggle to recover without the leader. This won't be their death. You retrieve the nearby Paragon from the wreckage, bring it back to your ship, knowing there's little time left to lose before the fleet catches up. Take one last look at your crew. To detonate this bomb means the collapse of the multiverse, and multiverse drives will simply cease to function. This will mean an end of the war, but it'll kill you and your crew, as well as strand billions of fellow multiverse travelers. The choice is yours, Captain. How does this end? Uh, talk with my crew. Ask the anointed. Uh, uh, Ainwith was, I think, the special crew. Come so far. You've done so well. I hope you know what must be done. Do not forget the importance of this mission. See, at the end of the day, it's your choice, Captain. Talk to anointed. If I, leader, if I, comma, leader of the, uh, of the augmented because eating just few royals, then you must be highest god. Okay, I guess this is just messed up English. Must be highest god in all of realm. Word might be hard between us, but hoping you understand this union most pleasant deciding on bomb. 
matters most do right of you. Okay. End the war or save my crew. Let's end the war for good. You know what you have to do. This war must end. No matter the cost, you've been given this chance. You won't pass it up. Your crew understands. They signed up to this act. This knowing very well they might die. You say your last goodbyes. Activate the bomb. Shockwave of the bomb spreads further outwards. First consuming your ship. Then the entire ancient homeworld. Erasing every last. Ancient advances entire fleet. Around the multiverse, billions of MV drives cease functionings. Much to the confusion of everyone. Inevitably, the Federation and rebellions of many realities were able to work out a truce. Knowing the lopsided balances of power would only spell the end for them. Their sacrifice will never be known. You put an end to the end-ending war and restored every reality back the way they were before. GG true ending. GG cookie time for true ending. <laughs> Even the FTL drive is not fast enough to get away from the detonation of a lower nuke. That's right. All right, have to uninstall multiverse. It's over. <laughs> uh, Vaseli Bankar, another gifted sub to Hollow. Thank you, sir. A true ending gives you goosebumps. Wow. People actually care about lore in this game? <laughs> All right. Well done, Admiral Billy, Sally Spartan, and everyone else. Swift Tiger. Hey, is Math Champ in here? Math Champ, your, needs, your name needs to be added there. Unless you're one of those people, but I don't think you are. You're a hyperspace mod now. You need to be on there. All right. 10,000 score! <laughs> With 147 jumps survived by this, uh, this dude. Oh man, that's crazy. Uh, it should just crash after the ending because Multiverse is dead, yeah. One of the features of FTL is how vague a lot of the story is. Probably intentionally so, yeah. You'd like it if detonating the bomb deleted your save file. Wow, okay. That would not be cool. Well, there we go. We finally got the true ending on Multiverse. And we do have time for another run today, which is what we'll do next. However, I have a friend that's going to be showing up in a few minutes. So I'm probably going to take a little bit longer break because these are long runs. So you all, thanks for hanging out. If there's anybody new to the stream, if you have, have a good time, I hope you enjoyed. Hit the follow. I'm probably going to be back, and it's probably going to be about 5 to 10 minutes while I wait for my friend to come. Uh, so I'm going to take a real break, but an extended break. And when we come back, we will do another run and see... Hopefully, if we can do not the true ending because it's such a long run. So, y'all rock. I will see you all in a bit. Enjoy this AFK screen while I uh, use the restroom and wait for my friend to arrive. Y'all rock. See you in a bit, my friends. <laughs>